want you to jump like you trying to get stuck in the air. Make you feeling so they don't care. Shorty beat in the face in the mirror, up in the air. I want you to jump, 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 up in the air. I want you to jump, jump. Good evening, Firebirds. Welcome back for another Wednesday night, Rainbow Six Siege night. Carthage Firebirds versus the Grays Harbor Chokers. Going to be a great game. Firebirds going 5-0 and in the season right now. Grays Harbor going, I think, 2-1 two, two to one right now? I, I think. Uh, uh, not, uh, I'm not They're sure. They're positive. <laughs> They're net positive yeah. in wins. So, uh, it's going to be a great night. It now, is. we do have some news. Have you heard the news, Toner? I have not heard the news. So... Carthage Esports, Rainbow Six Siege, our Siege team, going to playoffs for the Wisconsin R6 League. It's going to be absolutely amazing. Oh, April 2nd in, per in at Carthage, we're going to be streaming it to you all night. April 2nd, oh, uh, Wisconsin R6 <laughs> League cool. State Championship. We got well, we got the semifinals and the finals coming at you. And we'll be hosting. We'll be there right there. So Even me? Even you. Oh, let's I, go. Maybe you. <laughs> Uh, oh, oh. We'll see. We'll see. But <laughs> but it's going to be great. And I hope we win. I think Carthage is playing UW Madison right in the first oh, round. Wow. That's going to be a really, really good match. That's going to be a good. Now, one. Carthage College is the only team, I think, in that entire league to get any rounds on Madison. So that is going to be a very, very beautiful game to watch. Going to be very, very uh, difficult for the Firebirds, but we have the potential. We, we went seven to three against them. And again, we were the only team to get any rounds on them. That so. is awesome. But Truly that's wicked. in April. That's April 2nd. We are here now. Tonight's game. How are you feeling, Toner? Are you I'm, ready? Are I'm you ready? feeling pretty good. Right now, I'm in that business mindset. Mm -hmm. Just got out of my business class. But, you know, I'm, re I'm ready for some siege, getting my nerd on, you know, just yeah, a little bit. And we're coming off of spring break. So it's been a little bit. We might be a little yeah. bit rusty, but hopefully, hopefully not. Um, <laughs> But I think it's gonna be good. Our starting lineup for right now for the Firebirds, we got Quisby, we got Blue Phoenix, Ice Helix, or Blue Phoenix, Ice Helix, <laughs> Posy Guy, and to be I determined. Think Papa Plots. Papa? Papa oh, Plots. That's gonna be fun. I think we're gonna see some Papa Plots tonight. So I'm excited to see that. Uh it's gonna be pretty good. Cut our map lineup for tonight. We got Villa, we got Clubhouse. And we got Chalet. Uh, Papa Plotsk is online. Papa, so Papa, Papa Plotsk is coming on. <laughs> so we got Villa, we got Clubhouse, and we got Chalet on the map lineup. Uh, best of three game tonight. Villa's an interesting pick. Yeah. We, I, I'd say so. Did did uh did uh, the Firebirds pick that one or uh... I, I don't I don't know. I can't okay. I don't know. I don't know that. But I know that we've always I don't think we've picked it. But Firebirds have struggled, but I know we have put extra time this past two yeah. weeks planning strategies for Villa because we know we're a little bit rusty with it. So I'm hopeful because we have Villa, we have Clubhouse and Chalet down. Mm -hmm. So Villa, if we get really, really good at, I think I'm, 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 I'm hopeful to see how the strategies <laughs> yeah, work tonight. For sure. It, it's interest, interesting to see that Villa is the first one and also the Firebirds being on defense, but um, did I hear correctly that attacker repick? Oh yeah, the new season here. Attacker repick, which is this is so new. So the new season of Rainbow Six Siege started last week, and with it, bunch of new rule sets, a whole new operator that we won't see this year, unfortunately, this season, unfortunately. But the a big big change, attacker repick. So originally we had what was called pick six. So each team would pick their starting line, their their starting composition. Um, and then each team would, you know, the, their their compositions would be shown to each other. And then one person from each team had the, op well, everybody had the opportunity, but only one person could change operators. Mm -hmm. But now that's gone. That's gone. So now we have what's called attacker repick. So now 
attackers during that entire recon phase can change however many times they want mm -hmm. to whoever they want. And Defenders don't. They, That's they the don't. interesting thing. Defenders can now no longer change at all. So, so big question coming into this. So the Defenders, do they also get like that one no. pick card? Like they it, do not. It, it's all locked in. It is. They have. They're locked in and. The defenders don't get to see who the the other team's playing now. Ooh. It's completely different now. A lot of strategies wow. are probably going to be changing because of that. And one of my favorite highlights, there's some site changes. There's some, you know, just a bunch of changes all around. Mm -hmm. So this is a lot of these teams had to had to slightly change some of their strategies because certain things didn't work anymore. Certain things were better now. Um, and coming off and coming up in the NECC playoffs, we're going to see Thorn. Thorn's going to be added to the operator pool. Thorn having a, a mine that you can place somewhere that once someone walks into it, it'll go off and <laughs> I, I cause love, a lot of damage. I love pairing Thorn with uh, with frost mats and something oh, like that. Yes. It's it's a very good um, utility to use with other operators because normally people just run right through the util and it, and it won't get that effect. But if you get to get uh, the uh, attackers to get slowed down a little bit by a Malusi or a Capcan or uh, anything, then it's just oh, it yeah. is deadly. Well, and even if you don't get a kill, you still get that audio cue saying, hey, mm -hmm. someone's right here. For sure. And a lot of times people will, you know, swoop in and take care of them. Yeah. Uh, but, uh, go, going back to the map thing, like, like, you know, like Siege was always like defender sided. Mm -hmm. And um, I, I think that's where Carthage uh, has a little bit of an upper hand because we're very strong on attack. Mm -hmm. But with this, Firebirds being on defense with attacker repick, that could be a disadvantage. Mm -hmm. So that it's going to be very interesting to see tonight what's yeah. going to happen. It's going to force a lot of those gun plays to be very crucial as opposed to just pure out mm -hmm. uh, utility and abilities. Um, but we, I see we have some few, a few people in chat talking. That we got we got Mugen, we got Shaddy. And we got OBS. So glad to see their activity in chat. We have chat open. We're at, we have a three minute delay, but we'll try our best to keep to keep up with chat. I um, love seeing uh, Shady on there. I wonder who yeah. that is. They yeah, Shady is saying when you like look up fake fan in the dictionary, you get Galahad. Wow. You know, Galahad's my favorite player in Carthage Esports. I would say the same. I've seen him play some Overwatch, and I think Galahad's really, really good. I think Galahad is one of the best players on the Overwatch team. And we've seen him a few times on the Siege team. So yeah. like, I don't know. I think Galahad's pretty cool. But whoever this mystery Galahad person is, mm -hmm. I'm, 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 I'm I hope they're doing okay. I'm hoping they're doing okay. <laughs> I hope they had a good break. And um, I want I would love for them to come join me on the on the show. And I would love it too. So. <laughs> you know, yeah. bake some cookies and oh, uh, you know just just what's chill your out. favorite type of cookie i actually have no idea there's this one thing that my grandma makes it's mm -hmm. like this uh, special like minnesota cookie it like has a uh um uh, some sort of uh, what is it it's like a walnut at the top and then a mint inside Ooh, of it, it the, and it just has like a like a huge kick of flavor and minnesota is like a whole new country up there you know <laughs> <laughs> i love it I love it. <laughs> I, I I think I'm I'm a big fan of just you know good chocolate chip cookies. Yeah. I like soft baked. I don't like you know the really crunchy cookies. Yeah, um, for sure. Dude, do you like those chocolate chips like with like with the with the cube ones or do you like it with just like the little swirl ones? You know, Tony, like Tony, cheap? Tony. Between you and me, they're the same. They're just different shapes. I like the shapes though. I think the shapes. I, like the shape. I think the shapes. They all go in the the circle hole. I, or the I square know, hole. But I, 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 I don't care how they I, shape. They're going to go on the square I, I, hole. I think cubes taste a little bit different. Cubes than don't swirl. taste different. No. <laughs> not like it's chocolate. Don't. No. Cube chocolate. It, it's, it's different. How is it different? Elaborate. Teach us. We're definitely not stalling due to technical difficulties. Please tell us more about your cubes. Um, well, cubes, they... Uh... They have a sort of sweetness to them. A certain sweetness. A certain that sweetness. might be called chocolate. No, 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 no. But it's like it's like a cubed sweetness. It's not, it's not like you get with a swirl of like a Hershey. A cube is like impactful. It's some bigger word that I can't think of. You're you know? psychotic sometimes. You're psychic psychopath. That's what we. <laughs> That's I why don't I believe you. Fired. I don't believe you. I <laughs> don't think squares and cubes work. It's it's. Ugh, I don't know. I don't know. But um, you know, I I'm really excited. So back to Rainbow Six. Oh, I'm hey. really excited for the first time in however many years. We are getting a new map. 
We're getting oh, a new yes. map in Rainbow Six Siege. We are getting, it's called Emerald Isles. And I believe- no, Emerald Plains. Emerald Plains, sorry. I, ju I just looked that up. <laughs> Emerald Plains. They just announced it's on the test server right now, mm -hmm. but it is a city, it is a, a, a mansion or a castle. Yeah, it's like based, a country club. Yeah, it's a country club based in Ireland. Woo! Yeah, country clubs you, you know, in it's Ireland I'm sure are really nice. And the, the last map we got, Outback. Outback. Year four. Oh, yeah? Yeah. I believe the start of year four. And that's why like, I, it's been about three years mm -hmm. since we've gotten a new map. And this is gonna be insane. I am so happy for it. It it it, it looks good. It, oh, it looks it, so it, good. It, it it looks like it's gonna play amazing. And uh, the only thing that I'm bummed about is uh, it, you remember back. Uh, I think uh, uh, correct me if I'm wrong. Year two, we were supposed to get a Polish map for Sophia and Emma yeah, when they yeah. released. It was at like a train station. Um, back when they released two operators per yeah. season. Oh, and that, and that but, time, remember that we got the unique three operators. Oh yeah, that, the one that time they're crazy. like, we apologize, we're gonna give you three now, <laughs> and then they proceeded to no longer give us anymore. <laughs> they're just like, yeah, you know what? We used to do that. Uh, you're down to one. You're done. You're done. <laughs> you're done. I'm, I'm, I'm hopeful that this means a new start or a new beginning for Siege. Yeah, I think a lot of these developers are like, because I remember seeing some Reddit Q and A where they they said. That this is turning into a podcast right now. <laughs> <laughs> I like it. Don't they, stop. They, they said we could, I, I, I like it, but um, I forgot what I was talking about. Um, something about something on Reddit. So yeah, Reddit. There was a Reddit. Q &A, and someone asked if they're ever going to to the the Siege developers. If they're ever going to make a a, se a sequel to Siege. Um, and one of uh, the developers responded saying, "We're just going to make those improvements to Siege." And I think that is the great a great mindset to have. Because yeah. Siege right now, it has so much potential. You just need to continue adding new content. Yeah. And we're at this point where so much has, like, just, it's, we haven't gotten anything new outside of, like, a few a few new mm -hmm. operators and few map reworks, which even some of those are, like, barely even reworked. Yeah, but, like, this year seven oh, yes. is a game changer. I, I, this is the first time in a very long time that I've been so happy. Like, I've been completely happy. It feels like back at when I started in year two, but it looks like we're getting some comments. In, in I'm, I'm looking little, at that. I'm going, little, can little we get chats. it? Can somebody ban Shaddy from chat, please? I know. I, I, I don't know. I don't know why that the Shaddy is so aggressive towards Galahad. No, just pure anger. I know. Pure anger. This, 200 random this, people this, off the street. <laughs> how? That hurts my feelings. All right? That, that hurts. Yeah, that hurts my feelings. You know how they say uh, in the Big Lebowski, this, this, this aggression <laughs> cannot stand. Looks man. like Lugan's defending you in chat now. Tony oh, thinks you're doing different. Snickerdoodles Snicker are the best. I oh. Okay. No, I agree. They, JT, J, JT Lul. I think those, that's how you pronounce those it. Those are pretty good. I think Snickerdoodles are good, but. Um, oh, and, and what did Mugen say? Tony thinks cubes hit diff. Leave him alone, <laughs> <laughs> no they do they do thank you thank you mugen <laughs> I, I refuse to acknowledge blueberry oh they're wait De decadent? They're decadent i think that i think chat's currently going through our cookie discussion <laughs> that's, <laughs> three that, minutes that, behind. that's that we got three minutes alive which is awesome uh, but uh, i i'd like a quick definition please what does decadent mean? uh very good it's just a, okay. another way to okay. say like very good uh but with the I will add this because I completely forgot about this. We have a, an operator rework that was added to this new season. Oh, Goyo. And we might yeah. see a Goyo tonight. I know Goyo is very, very good now. Mm -hmm. So that is we might see that. And I really hope we do because I really like the changes. For sure. I almost say it's a, to the line of broken almost. I mean, four gas canisters can place them anywhere you want in 20 seconds of fire if i'm yeah. not wrong 20 it, it's it's a lot of seconds That's now a lot. originally goyo was able to put these these gas canisters on the shields on these deployable shields that when shot would cause you know the shield mm -hmm. to break in a big explosion of fire but now that goyo can place those those gas canisters anywhere yeah. and i've noticed a lot of people are using it to block drone holes oh that is smart that is that is really smart i think it's it's interesting because it's it's, what's stopping broken. someone from just shooting it and then causing you know fire and stuff that yeah. could that could cause a lot of issues for some players or for the defenders. But we'll see how it works. But but also like think of it this way: like if you put one on every single entry and it's the last twenty five seconds of the match, 
they have to push through the fire. How? Like that is just no. insane. And 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 twenty seconds roughly of fire. Mm-hmm. Like that's just that you can you can cause like I mean you have four canisters. Yeah. Twenty times four, eighty seconds. That's over a minute. Almost a minute and a half yeah. of fire. That is a majority. That is of crazy. The, that is ha- that is half. And, and of just, the just imagine having a tachanka as well. Yes. The oh amount of fire. There's so much fire. Hey, uh, d- do you think we could play a little bit of siege after this and we're, try this right out? We're gonna play the beard. Uh, suddenly, we're gonna enter our own. We're gonna enter our own school in this program. The bearded man and toner. Uh, <laughs> it's gonna the, be a two v five rainbow six siege. We'll pull it out. We can start our own college. We're gonna start our own college. <laughs> Shoutcasting University. Oh, that would um, be fun. Oh, and it. and looks like uh, oh Shaddy's back with the butterscotch Graham. Graham cookies okay. are okay. The I'm not a big fan of butterscotch, but that does sound pretty good. I will that, say that. That is very so, interesting. I got the nod from Shaggy. So. <laughs> <laughs> I can imagine. I can imagine. My producer. Sorry. My producer. Yeah. I, don't, the I, don't know I think Shaddy my producer is. likes that too. But <laughs> Grace Harbor Chokers. This is a school. I, I, I learned a little bit. So I was a little bit confused. I didn't know what a choker was. And then I looked on the website and they explained it. So basically a choker is a it's a the way it, it sounded to me it was a lumberjack that collects wood from the water oh they they put like chains on the, the logs and stuff which that's is really cool i think that's really cool that, and the fact that that's their mascot is like pretty pretty cool that, so. that that's a very interesting thing that that uh that actually kind of reminds me of something back at home in minnesota minnesota there, there's this museum it's a uh, pillsbury museum and they actually talked about that when uh when we were in the milling days of that but I had no idea they were called chokers. That's a fun fact of the day. Yeah. So I'm getting word that our technical difficulties are actually a little bit more serious. So I think we will unfortunately go for a break because Toner and I, we are out of we're out of time to stall. So we will be back once we get these fixed. Uh, we apologize for this inconvenience and hopefully we can get them fixed very, very soon. So we'll catch you in a bit. See your future on the horizon? So do we. It's really just the greatest college experience I could have asked for. What really drew me in was having an adventure. I think something really unique about Carthage is that it constantly pushes you outside of your comfort zone. At Carthage College, we will push you to dive deep, to channel your curiosity, and excel in your chosen field. like an individual journey through collaborative effort. And so overall, this has been my college experience, but so many people that I've met have been supportive along the way and they're all looking out for you. So that's really why it feels like a family. As you ignite your true potential and start asking the hard questions, you'll find that the answers are just the beginning. That's the moment your purpose comes into view. We are really able to get great one-on-one action with our professors. So you can't hide in your classroom. You're always actively participating. You'll get recommended for things that you might not have ever been interested in before, and you end up realizing that that might be your passion. Everyone here is just so nice, so welcoming. It's really easy to make friends here at Carthage. The biggest change was going from student to young business professional. I love Carthage. It's definitely the people. Living on the lake is amazing. I feel very prepared for my future. Ended up surpassing my expectations. Some things you just need to see for yourself. Come take a closer look at Carthage College. After some technical difficulties, I hope you missed us. We missed you. I missed you, Toner. Oh, I missed you. Oh my gosh. But we're back. We're, we're back. starting. <laughs> we are starting on map yeah. one. Villa. Firebirds are defending and the chokers are attacking. Um I like this. Now this is gonna be really interesting to, to go. Who Ooh. do you think they're gonna ban? I think it's gonna be a Thatcher ban. Because you know I agree. Thatcher. I agree. Um here's the thing though. Interesting. I- I- interesting Lee is that there's a new animation for all there of There is. It. And we got a whole. So, look hey, at it. So that's your, I knew all it. Right, we are one for one. All right. All right. Attacker, one. attacker on this map. Uh, I think. Uh, 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 um, 
I'll go with Jackal. I'm gonna, go, I'm gonna go. Yeah, I'm gonna go Jackal. I have to. I think Jackal. Uh, two for two, two for two, two and for two. And if they don't ban Jackal, it's gonna game change. Yes. Yeah. It's, yeah, it's Stature Jackal. It is always that. All right, <laughs> Defenders. Okay. I think Cade is very powerful in this map, so I'm gonna go Cade. I'm gonna go Mira for the. Okay. For the first one. Because I think Mira is also a good ban, but that might be the second one. Oh, uh, yeah. I'm gonna lock at him. I'll go Mira. I'm gonna go Cade. Three for three. Let's go! Wow. <laughs> I know I know Mira's good on this map, but like honestly. Cade! Uh, it's gonna be Cade now. It's gonna be Malusi. Oh <laughs> it's gonna be Malusi. It might be Malusi. <laughs> Malusi is so good on this map. It's what? Valk! Okay, I'll take three for four. Seventy five percent, wow. that's a C plus. But, I, so Cade's C? completely open now. <laughs> um that's interesting. I think Valk's good on this map, but also like because I... it's such a close quarters map. There's not many good spots for Valk cams. Uh, there's a there's a few good ones. I'd say there's one underneath the um uh, the bench. Uh, mm -hmm. If you see yeah, I know, up, but up that's right something there. like you can easily see like yeah. Something. But it looks like our starting lineup for the Firebirds is gonna be Cade, Legion, Maestro, Jaeger, and Aruni. A very very solid Aruni. pick. <laughs> I love Aruni. Quizby's Quizby and I. Rooney is just the best. For and sure. for the chokers, this is a good this is an interesting lineup. We got a Dokabi, a Yana, IQ, Thermite, and Nomad. Ooh. Um, but they have attack and repick, so honestly, that could change. Yeah, I'd say this is very, very, very strong. And 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 correct me if I'm wrong, the fibers cannot see that. Fibers they, cannot see I don't know actually. What I don't they know. Have. I have don't think so. Huh? I don't know. It's completely different now. <laughs> we don't get the same. We don't get to see it the same. Uh, the, we don't have the same like visuals as they do. We get to see the spectator, the special spectator. We're, we're a little so. bit special. We're a little bit special. You know, <laughs> a little special treatment. <laughs> but but that, that is going to be very strong as what well, like like Yana is. Ooh, very powerful weapons. Nomad, like ooh. just great utility overall. And it, it, it's just going to be very tough. This is cool. I <laughs> got the new controls now. I got control of this, the cameras. So oh, no. I get to experience it. <laughs> Oops, oh, zoom in. Again. We're zooming in on pause again. Whoa. 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 <laughs> so, what, do you, what do you think of their defenses? I think it's a very a, a very solid hold on this map. It's There's very little room for any sort of um, change, you know? Yeah, I I think very solid overall. It, it's very standard, a very standard uh, way of defending this site. Um, so we got. It looks like they stay. The, it looks like the chokers stayed the same though. So yeah. chokers are going nomad thermite IQ Iana Dokubi Dokubi having that that massive hack that can. Oh, that was, <laughs> that, was weird to see. <laughs> that massive hack to change it up just a little bit that hack that will call every uh, defender's phones mm -hmm. alerting them of the their position just by a um an audio cue however um so this is hard to talk about <laughs> by, by by killing one of the defenders they will drop a camera which mm -hmm. dokubi can then hack which will hack all the intel uh cameras on the defender side so basically all cams will be accessible to the attackers which is very very good but then again dokubi has to get on top of that now it looks like Point Blank is pushing from that study side. Um, Mama's got a beard is pushing from that as well. I think going from going through study is a very solid. We got that Dokubi looking at Red Stair. Um, so a bit of a split push going from first floor and also going from the balcony side. And second, see IQ going from underneath, trying to destroy any of those electronics that they see. As you can see, she has a little bit of a, a thing. Uh, a little bit of a, a, a camera, in a sense. They can see through walls and detect any sort of electronics. Um, very powerful move. Quizby holding games room behind the bar. Having that angle. Blue Phoenix roaming, trying to look into that, that classical area. It's a very um, strong spot. I see oh, there we go. Early pick. That was good timing on my part. That was beautiful to see, but they oh. were able to get that wall oh. destroyed. But I see it's getting that pick on Rasmussen. Nice. And now it kill. is a 5v3. Nice it looks like Dokubi got hit by uh, uh, the Legion mine. But nice aim. It's oh, going wow. To going to get a little bit. But Blue are we going to see an ace? I don't know. Three kills so Just, far. Oh, Blue Phoenix didn't even know they were oh. there. 
Oh, Chunker is pu pushing Ponce the same guy, pushing around. Ponce Ponce guy getting run! Can he get another one? He gets... That was, that was beautiful to see! Great first wow. round! <laughs> beautiful! Chat's going beautiful. off a little bit. We got that... Mugen, Papa Plant. <laughs> it's a Papa Plant. We got Obs shouting out Quizby. Quizby, the captain of the team, doing an amazing job. <laughs> Has a huge fan base, too. Huge fan base. <laughs> I'm a big fan. I'm a like, big fan. She, is, she does wonders. So her strategies... <laughs> Her strategies are so good. Oh, for but sure. It looks like for the Firebirds on round two, Ooh. still defending. We got a Cade, we got a Legion, we got a Frost, we got a Jaeger, and a Thunderbird instead of a Rooney. Very interesting. They're going second floor trophy and statue. And now, <laughs> on the um on the other side, having an Ashiana, Maverick, Thermite, and Nomad. Switching out the IQ for a Maverick. And also, um, who they swap out for the for the Ash? Dokubi. Oh, that's right. <laughs> but also, again, attack and repick. So, like, they could easily change that. Yeah. And we, well, we will know, but the other team won't. Whether or not they can see that, I don't know. I, but here's, I, I, here's I, the funny thing. Okay, Thunderbird. Yeah. Having those Kona stations that she could place down to, to heal around, uh, heal anybody in that radius. Mm -hmm. People don't, some people don't like Thunderbird. So yeah. that's an interesting pick I like to see. Uh, but not, as we see that. Quizby placing down those Kona stations around, trying to make it, putting it in areas that, uh, you it, know, it's defenders the, can go yeah, to but heal. It, but it's hard for the attackers exactly. to, to go to, and that's what's really important about these Kona stations. You almost have to guard them, because if the attackers take them over, you know, they could be at full health after a fight, and it it would not be very good. Now, Papa Plonsk is trying to put those K charges, whereas uh, it looks like Nice aim, switching, using the attacker repick, but staying on Maverick. I think just changing the loadout a little bit. But yeah. Quisby is moving some of those Kona stations. Blue Phoenix, once again, roaming as Jaeger. Beautiful to see. I, I, I'm roaming, I but staying near point now that I say that. Yeah, I don't think so. Maverick is going to work out too well for this. There's not that many spots that he's completely good, unless they take over uh, Master Bedroom. And then they can take uh, put, put a few holes into that big wall. But um, it all depends on where they're pushing. It looks like that is what they're going to they're do. They're pushing in through bathroom. Going to be an interesting choice. I think Point Blank is trying to get that, or pushing through bedroom. Yeah. Going to probably join it. Uh, yeah. We got nice aim. Getting, oh, getting an early pick on Quisby inside a bathroom. But taking a lot of damage as well. A lot of damage. Going there to use that grenade made. on the staircase. But honestly, nobody's down there, so it wasn't much. But oh, they know the location. Oh, and there he go. falls to Papa. Uh oh. oh. Papa Flans unfortunately getting picked off. That Instantly was a really nice hurted. refrag. Pause, you guy. What are those uh, Roman numerals again? Uh, 4711. 470. 4711. 4711. <laughs> of no relation to the convenience store. Which I, I love their, their, their big gulps. You know. I gotta go to Settler. I think I've Good. only been one. Now, the Firebirds have that bulletproof camera right there that we just saw. Gonna cause a lot of issues for them. They're droning out. Pause guy knows they're there. 3 4 for the Firebirds right now, and it looks like 2 to 3. You got the air jab on the staircase. Still thinking somebody's gonna be coming from the staircase. Ice Helix causing a lot of holes in the side. Will they get the pick? Oh, oh you almost got it. Got it half health, but there's the Kona station there. Oh, and oh. there goes there goes point blank. Unfortunately, pause the guy holding that angle, but noticing their smoke, able to get that Very nice. on the thermite. That was beautiful because he just hit right behind it. But oh. having to reload, this might be it. Ice is getting the pick on rest. Listen, it is now a 3v1. Yana being the last one alive. Hiding behind that wall. The diffuser is <laughs> the diffuser is over there. So that, there's no way they get no where they could go. There's nothing, not much they can do. Gonna push through bathroom, it looks like. Um uh oh, Ice Felix getting gunned down, unfortunately, but Blue Phoenix is there to probably maneuver. Remaneuver. Uh, but it all depends on what 4711 is actually going to do. Holding that quasi oh, guy. guy. Oh. Uh -oh. oh, but getting the pick. It's a 1v1. Uh oh. Oh no. Having to switch. 15 seconds left on the clock. It is. Seconds to go. There is a Kona station by Pazzi. 10 seconds. Oh! oh. Very Beautiful. nice. Beautiful. Firebird safe round two. 
That was oh. a beautiful play by We Parker. got some fans in the chat. We got Quisby some... front and center from Blueberry Spaceship Box. Quisby a unit for show. JT Lul. <laughs> and again, it... with the Ice Helix had a good triple, though. I, I agree. agree. That was a solid Agreed. triple by Ice Helix. <laughs> and Ayub's a also. Ops. <laughs> ops and Ops. Ops <laughs> two eight. <laughs> So. I'm so sorry, Ops. We got a great fan base, it. so we're sorry if you, we we're sorry if we can't say. It. But Firebirds round three, their defense is really strong, but it they're is, changing it up. It's different. They're continuing to change that. it up, which a is pulse. I like this now. Papa Plant's going Cade. Uh, Plaza guy going Legion. Ice Helix going Malusi. Blue Phoenix going Jaeger and Quisby going Pulse. Strong. That Pulse is gonna be really really good. That heartbeat sensor being able to. Detect any heartbeat within that certain range through walls. Um, Quisby going to be able to call out their yeah. location, and hopefully somebody will be able to come in and take care of it. I, I think Quisby might be playing downstairs in the basement, mm -hmm. trying to get because they, uh, the fibers will be forced to go to first floor now, mm -hmm. I believe. Defending so playing in basement, that is very that. interesting to see. Um, I, I mean, that that's my prediction. No, I don't know if it's uh, actually going to happen. They're in, yeah, they're in kitchen. They're in the kitchen right now. They're gonna make a cake. Cooking some meals, maybe Cooking some, some cookies. Meals. Gonna celebrate our uh, playoffs. <laughs> Going to playoffs for the Wisconsin League. Hopefully, make it. Or hopefully, they're gonna make some uh, of those uh, cubed cookies. I do like those. So this is what it looks like to be a huge player. You know, we got ice cubes. <laughs> for those who don't know, because it's you know you get some weird perspectives. This is what it's actually like. For somewhat, you get a little bit of a different display, but like this is what it's like. They have they 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 see the map differently. Compared to what we do, they don't see, you know, through the walls and stuff. Yeah. And they got to, you know, as you can see, they're strategizing these different um, re reinforcements and, and their hold. Uh, unfortunately, it looks like Ice Helix wanting a rotate hole right there. Oh, no. Pa wanting Papa oh. Plants to use that Cade Claw to electrify it. <laughs> it's interesting trying to see, like, the language with the pings and all that mm -hmm. and see what they're trying to get. Now, obviously, they have cam they have microphones right now, too. So they're, yeah. they're being, you know, they're using audio to communicate what they we're, want. We're <laughs> just trying to figure out what they're actually trying to say. I agree. But it looks like <laughs> the uh, Choker's oh. going a Finca, Thermite, Sledge, and a second yeah. floor push. Second floor push. Probably getting, getting a pick on Nice Aim, but, but for 7-Eleven trading, or not trading, before 7-Eleven getting that pick on Pause Guy, um, Pause Guy got Nice Aim, and 4-7-Eleven got Pause Guy. Um, unfortunate, but I think we can, I think it's a 4v4 four four yeah, right now. Yeah, 4v4 four all four tied v up. A little bit Pause of damage. Here we go. Here's that heartbeat sensor we were talking about. Yeah, it looks like Quisby's not playing basement, so th th this is good too because it looks like the chokers are pushing from the second floor. Mm -hmm. So that C4 is going to be helpful here pretty soon. And for the chokers, they're nomad placing almost all their charges on second floor, so it's going to be tough for the defenders to try and go up there. Yana going down the red stairs right now. Holding that angle. Really, really interesting. Looks like the thermite is falling right behind her. There's thermite. Oh, there's a fight. <laughs> and Ice Helix takes out a uh, four, four Ice Helix getting, getting another double kill. Getting a double kill there. And the diffuser is down for the chokers. Ice Helix was going seven and one. You gotta this is hard to control the camera <laughs> and talk. Like I'm trying to figure out because it's, it's kind of fun. Some of these buttons are hard to yeah. figure out what, what I'm trying to press. Nomad drops down for the chokers. Takes a lot of damage and like five health right now. Wow, a lot of stuff's happening. Oh, I is getting the pick up point blank. It is now a 4v1. And Rasmussen has like no health. <laughs> Kenny finishes Quisby. off with a four kill. Quisby oh, knows. Quisby. Quisby knows. There, there we go. go. That is beautiful. We got some chats. We got a blueberry spaceship box again with clothes. JT Posse with J the clutch. JT Lul Posse with the clutch. Obs, it's okay. Lol, shirt for short, short for oh, sorry. <laughs> oh wow. <well. laughs> I, I, I still like, I like Obs. Actually. I think that's a that's a pretty good name. Obs. 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 It's like Kelvin. Two, two. Kelvin and Hobbs. Oh, Kelvin and Hobbs. <laughs> that, 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 but, that's a good comment. Okay. <laughs> so, round number four for the Firebirds. Firebirds leading three and zero right now. And they're going back up to Aviator. Back to Aviator in games. Uh, running the same comp that we saw. 
Cade, Legion, Maestro, Jaeger, Rooney. If it ain't broke, don't fix if it. If it ain't broke, don't fix it. And I think this is showing that we have full-on strategies yeah. for everything. We got um, the momentum and, going right now. Well, and we've so we've shown that like we are we have multi-operator players. Mm -hmm. Like nobody is like a, a one trick, you know. But uh we, we're able to, you know, adapt when we need it. And the chokers um hopefully hopefully know how to hopefully know it, know what we're gonna run and yeah, can can adjust their strategy accordingly yeah i'm hoping that the firewoods will keep up this momentum though because it has just been almost flawless so far very very proud of it oh and it looks like shady is throwing some shade at galahad and chat again i am not liking that i don't like i don't like the shady i am not shady liking the shady guy but <laughs> we got a question in chat blueberry spaceship box what was the triangle trap they put on the wall very good question that was a, that's a great question so malusi that was the malusi operator uh, played by, I think it was Ice Helix. I, th but, I think so. Um, basically, I think Mugen's going to answer that right now, but I'm going to answer it too. So basically, it is an, it, it's almost like a proximity alarm. Yeah. Where when an attacker enters the proximity, it'll go off. It'll send out vibrations that slow, that slow the, the attacker who's in the radius while also... <laughs> yeah, who can say yeah. it? There you go. Okay, uh, we gotta be faster. Gotta be faster. <laughs> anyway, in, in summary, it's called the wub wub, and the wub wub slows down it's, people it plays that walk. Step. Yeah, it goes wub wub wub. wub, wub. wub so then, wub, when people wub, walk wub, into it, they get slowed down, but it also does an audio cue for the defenders. So it's it's very strong. Very, I, I like it. <laughs> now it looks like some of the chokers going down, going a first floor push. Yeah, it looks like they're trying to do almost the same thing, but they're attacking from a different direction, possibly putting that ash to the other side of the map to try and squeeze. Queen Space on the bar. Queen oh, Space on the bar. What she? What? 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 what, what they doing up there? <laughs> trying to, trying to, trying to surprise people. A bomb has been located. <laughs> Sneaking around. Ice Helix with some really cool cams in 90 right now. Okay, so two chokers are now they okay. Me. Here's the interesting thing: the chokers haven't destroyed cameras. Yeah, I I'm not one to comment, but like, why? I, I, <laughs> that, I, I, now I, we know exactly where they're pushing from. We know what operators they're playing. That intel that we can get from that camera is very important, and honestly gonna be bad for the chokers i i am one to judge because that but there's that there's that iq again <laughs> destroying those cake claws from below which i think that's a good i think that's a really good really good play on their part yeah and i, I thought they were gonna push up red but it looks like they're gonna do a full back push and go over to aviator so they're going to the site that they played on round two and pushing from there so it's a big flank there's quizby there's quizby <laughs> i'm just gonna focus on the firebirds it's just easier. I have five buttons to worry about now. If I focus on the Firebirds, it's a little fun in the studio. A minute left, and no fights have been initiated so far. A really so slow push from the chokers. the chokers. They really want. But it looks like they're looking. Oh, Ice Heal is getting that early pick on, or early, not early. That pick. Oh, on, they looks like they're gonna push in. Pause the guy getting that pick on four seven eleven. And looks like uh, we might be having an audio problem. Maybe we just lost audio. But we can <laughs> still commentate. That's it. That's we'll see. Nice aim getting a. Oh no! Mom's got a beard. Unfortunately, Choker's getting a bunch of kills right now. Two v three for the Firebirds right now. Mama's got a beard. And the She's planting. Are planting. <laughs> Two seconds to stick. And they That's do correct. forty five seconds. That's on the clock. Oh, I see. We got audio. We just Papa can't hear. Papa Plonsk it. is. Town. It's now just Quizby 1v3, I have but faith. they don't know that Quizby's Quiz right B. there. Quizby! Quizby! Quiz Watch that Claymore, Quizby! Watch Quizby! Watch Claymore, Quizby! Oh, getting the there down, go. which is good, but uh, it looks like Rasmussen is outside holding that angle. Uh-oh. But Quizby knows they're there. 20, 20 seconds, seconds left. Quizby's going to have to run around. Got to run in. Not oh. Good. Unfortunately, falling to nice aim. That side of push was just too much for the firebirds they mm -hmm. couldn't get any good angles and that that rush plant with that smoke grenade which was really really um scary but um we'll see how this goes now round five for the firebirds going th three v one three to one right now three to one it's best to set first to seven in the in this case win by two and it looks like uh, the firebirds are going to go to the other side of the map so going to a uh, trophy room and statuary room um this is gonna be very interesting. 
Oh, blueberry spaceship boxes. Thanks for the detailed explanation, Caster. You Thank are you. very you welcome. Are very welcome. <laughs> but we can hear some audio, which is good. We can hear parts of the game, but not all of it. Yeah. We can hear like the little, you know, the the the, the time clocking down. The, yeah, the, time. the the narrator. No, no, no guns though. No guns. <laughs> we got no guns. We got no music. So. Oh, and oh. it looks like uh, we're gonna do work. They're taking fixing a, it. Taking a that quick man, pause. Not, oh. code to our producers. But music went all the way down. Oh, I love the music. But yeah, we couldn't hear the gunshots, which is... Oh, now we can hear, now we can hear music. music. Now we can dance. As, asking for a friend, do you all have SSDs? No, oh, don't. No, don't even. Don't even acknowledge that. That's not... They're, they're, they're trying to... It's, we're doing our best. <laughs> but... Looks like Quizby setting up those Kona stations again. Blue Phoenix going vigil, going to go for that roam, which is going to be really interesting to see. Um, now we can hear things, so audio is fixed. Yeah. But uh, just a little bit of a glitch there. But that's it's a that's little, a given with when it comes to esports. A little low. <laughs> Lazy guy going Legion. Oh. <laughs> so much is happening in the studio right now. Papa Blanche going from underneath, which is an interesting choice because. The chokers have kept doing that yeah. first round, that first floor push. Now, but this time they don't have that IQ. To they don't have that IQ, traps. which is good. Good for the Firebirds, I'll say that. But they have a Maverick, and Maverick's Blowtorch can destroy electrified walls. So I think that uh, might be really good for them in the long run. We'll see how this goes. Mama's got to be going up to second floor into that master bedroom. It looks like they're gonna do the master bedroom push once again. Yeah, it, it looks like that flanking that they used the, um, the last run, they're gonna try and do it again, but this time from the other user. side. Oh, it looks like Thermite for the chokers is in a frost mat. Ooh. In a frost mat. Well, we'll see. This is what it looks like when you fell into a frost mat and regret your choices. Now I'm saying taking out. But Blue Phoenix feelings. getting that early, that 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 the chokers getting that pick on uh, the roamer. Yeah, but but Mama's got a beard, also at 20 health, and Nomad being at five. So it's really tight right now. Firewood's being at full health. You control. Well, I, I'm control, here's the controls. Uh, <laughs> uh, two, two, Wait, three. Okay, I'll control. Okay, you I'm control. Sorry. <laughs> Let me a quick change. But what are we gonna do? Blue Ice Felix getting an angle into uh, in he's holding a trophy room really well right now. Quizby holding that astronomy. Blue Phoenix on cameras though, looking for any calls. Pause yeah, guy. Looks like they're looks like they're getting a phone call from Dokabi. Yeah, Nomad is pushing up just a little bit. Oh, I feel like taking a little, a little bit of damage. damage, but there's that Kona station to <laughs> healing him back to full health. Not a problem. Put a little bit of band-aid on and you're good to go. A little bit of band-aid. A little bit of a band-aid. They're like paintballs. <laughs> a paintball band-aid. Nice team. <laughs> nice team. Needs some of those heals. And Mama's got a beard. They got okay. So Chokers, what they did is they used that Maverick to open up a little bit of a floor. And here we go. Mama's got a beard. Placing a thermite charge on that wall to blow it open. Yeah, this is going to be really deadly right now with that master bedroom open. Bomb by Every, oh. fall, falling to the Maverick. But there's a Woo. nice refrag from Papa Plotsk. Ice Helix attacking from the other. It is now over that courtyard. They're doing a, they're doing a firefight. Mama's got a beard has planted in the future once again. 40 seconds on the clock. Firebirds need to defuse, and it is a 1v4 right now. Two of the chokers are very low health. So Papa, oh. Oh, Mama's got a beard getting a pick on Papa Plonsk. That is very unfortunate, I think. But. Yeah, this uh, looks like the momentum has paused a little bit for the Firebirds as we go into round six. Three to two. I Three think two. the Firebirds. This. I think it might. Some of these tactics that the Chokers are using are different. I think yeah. the Chokers are committing, fully committing to destroying these walls. Yeah. And once the Firebirds can navigate around that, it, it's just going to be good. And it looks like they're trying to. With Quizby going Warden and Ice Helix going well, my. So they're really trying to get grenades and that sort of util out of the way. Well, but, my is an arrow. Uh, Warden is an interesting pick because. The chokers never played Ying. Yeah. And ultimately, 
I don't know. I feel like we're not seeing much projectile play from the chokers. Yeah, I, I I'd agree with that. It's gonna be very interesting. But obviously, Quizby is a captain, so they they must know something that we don't. <laughs> so it's gonna be very interesting. We also saw um them play uh, Warden a little while back, and it worked really well. Mm -hmm. So maybe it was just a. Uh, Maybe just for that MPX, the one that Valkyrie also has. To locate and defuse bombs. Yeah. Oh, we got a, a first chat time from chat from a viewer. Illusion. Welcome. <laughs> Welcome, Empty Illusion. Welcome to the chat. <laughs> oh, what, what is that emote? Is that a... Uh... The Carthage logo. I do like that. I do. I like those emojis. We got some really good emojis in chat. I'm, so. just, I'm just a little bit colorblind, so I can't really tell what this <laughs> Don't thing worry. it is. Don't worry. But... Here we go, round six. Let's get hyped up, Toner. Let's get hyped up. Yeah, yeah, a little, a little bit more. <laughs> well, now they're going Aviator again. Going yeah. Aviator and Games Room. Um, so trying to get the solid defense on the, the second floor. So it's going to be very interesting to see what they're going to do. I think they're going to do the same push again, trying to flank around, going over to uh master bedroom go from there quizby <laughs> on top of the bar it's interesting to see i mean the thing about c just like a lot it, it takes time for them to breach so there's yeah. not much we can really say but it looks like they're gonna breach from that side yeah into study once again or no was that master bedroom yeah master bedroom they're doing the same flank that they did uh the last time wow, these are some interesting strats that like you don't really see yeah it's one of it's one of my favorites to do i like putting a uh, um a uh, knock and, and go, going hurt and going to the other side and doing that oh but it looks like someone is somebody's repelling so they know that there's people in study again chokers are not destroying these outside cameras yeah but that... it, pause a guy getting some getting some sh shots through the floor i think which might work out for them Rasmussen, you know, Rappel trying to trying to figure out their next push. Um waiting for them to, to use the Dokubi call. Um we might we might hear that in a second though. Well I see is throwing out those will my discs that will um magnetize and, and mm -hmm. attract any sort of projectiles. But again, we haven't seen many projectile play. We have that Maverick grenades, but that's about it. And uh, we have the smoke grenades too. But and there goes the call. Oh, I I mean that makes sense. Quizby, oh. so Warden can see through smoke grenades. I forgot about that. Yeah. So that, that makes sense. Oh, ha have they been playing? So oh, they've been oh, taking a lot of damage. damage. Taking a lot of damage from that. Oh, no. Oh, my gosh. They're breaching through Vault. Very interesting. These are strats again that, I've, that you just don't see. Wow. Oh, I see that it's getting a double kill. And 4711 getting that pick on Pauzy Guy. It is now a 2v2. 55 seconds left on the clock. They're using that last Dokubi call. call right now. They probably have camera access right now, but I don't think it's much of an issue. Rasmussen uh -oh. seeing that somebody's right there, but Icelix has no idea. But then there's Blue Phoenix, who's watching the doorway, just waiting. Loading mag. Yeah, 35 seconds left on the clock, so the chokers need to push this. Blue Phoenix, they know they're there. Right I mean, now, and the key with defense is if you're on defense, away. don't push. Yeah. Just hold. I'm guilty of that. But it looks like oh, they're planting right now. And I see this getting down in the process. Blue Phoenix needs to take care of this. The, and, the, and the diffuser stuck. has gone off. They bought seconds. a little bit more time. And I think Blue Phoenix is in a very unfortunate spot right now because there's not much they can do. Ow. Yeah, that was good play. That was a good play by the chokers. Yeah, I will say the, these strats have been used a long time ago when Villa was first yeah. released. I haven't seen that in a very no. long time. A push through vault. I, I and and just the way that they split push that. It's just like these strats well are, are, are old but effective. Well, and I think it's catching the firebirds off guard. Yeah. They're expecting these different pushes. They're these expecting meta. That aren't, they're expecting meta and they're expecting you know things that aren't as like because yeah. i think i think a lot of these strategies that the chokers are playing high risk high reward yeah and obviously they're rewarding it and the firebirds are not expecting plays like this first of all they're not destroying cameras i'm still not over that hey, that's the what chokers that's, are destroying cameras that's so one of my pet peeves like the firebirds just know all of these locations yeah but 
Now the Firebirds have a chance to attack. It is tied right now, three to three right now. And as we know, the Firebirds on attack is very deadly. We have a really good stretch. So it's gonna be interesting if we can turn the tide here and get our momentum back. I agree. We got Papa Plants going Ace, Pause Guy going Kali, of course. Of course. I see it going IQ, pulling out that IQ to take, to, to, to counter it, to counter it a little bit, you know? Yeah. Uh, counter those electronics, making Attacking sure that they can disable it. And, um, Quiz be going Osa. I love Osa. I, I love, love Osa. Osa. I think Osa is it really is good. It's great to see Osa. Now. now the Choker's going a Jaeger Thunderbird again? Oh, okay. this is more Thunderbird play that we've ever seen. No, um, I haven't played Siege in, in a while. I, I'm a little bit rusty, but I, I I thought the consensus was not to play Thunderbird, but, but, but both teams have played people Thunderbird. Have so people I, have, we've, we've I, had discussions <laughs> before where Thunderbird people don't like, but but you know if it, if it's working i'm not gonna argue that they're the pros not me <laughs> i agree now it's 4 7 11 going mute i always say mute is so much more powerful than electric I and we agree. brought both we brought kate and we got mute so. and it's very interesting also having mute because uh with with, with all these changes with attacker repick and uh, with defenders being locked in what's very important is to have that intel from drone so if you can deny that with mute or with mozzie that's going to give you a huge advantage. I agree. Pause yeah. guy droning into second floor art studio right below point, trying to make sure that nobody's holding. Papa Plonsk and Quizby are pushing through study. Osha, that Osha shield's going to do really, really well if they place it right there. Um, there's a lot of impact grenades that are probably going to counter some of those Osha shields. For sure, we got but two. Nice name. Right at the top of Red Stair. Oh, that's Ooh. gonna be deadly. They're getting those cameras though. Firebirds are taking care of the cameras. Uh oh, and uh, we have lost uh, Papa Plans is noticing again. that Malusi. Oh, now we're back. <laughs> Blue Phoenix and Papa Plans taking a little bit of damage. Choker's at full health right now. There's so that bulletproof camera. Oh, the oh, guy giving the pick on nice aim. Very they nice. know there's a Malusi trap right at the bottom of the stairs. But will they know that? I don't think anybody's on stairs right now. How's the guy throwing, throwing that prey. grenade? Just a little bit. Gonna hopefully open up that. There we go. I knew it. Opening up or waiting for that Malusi trap to open up and then shooting it, causing it to just disappear. <laughs> Oof. But great, there's a firefight fire. in that side stairs. But the Firebirds have moved into study so they can slowly push in. A lot of firefights. They're oh, Blue Phoenix getting the pick on four seven eleven. Very nice. Quizby gra gathering a lot of intel. They are able to get safe. that that Maverick hole in so they can disable that those those electrics and opening up line of sight onto point four v three. Blue Phoenix falling to the Jaeger. 50 seconds left on the clock. Slow, but they need they need to push a little. Oh, I mean, they're playing. I see it. Pretty slow. Right there. Could be getting right that early that pick. Why do I keep saying early pick? I don't know. But there's the Ooh. Kade. The back is turning. The Kade's back is turning. Getting sandwiched in. Oh, but part of the guy getting the pick on rest mission. And now Papa uh -oh. Plonsk is planting. Quizby and Pause and, guy. And I hear a nitro cell. Oh. Nobody's there to destroy it, to activate it. And it's now <laughs> just Thunderbird who's hiding behind Bar. But the diffuse is planted, and Pazzy Guy knows. Pazzy Guy knows where Mama's got a beard is. <laughs> yep. Where the Thunderbird is, behind the bar. But they just so. got to wait it out. It's kind of flipping the script. Attackers mm -hmm. are now defenders, and defenders are now exactly. trying to attack. And, of course, as you can see, that Thunderbird trying to push through Vault, but second having fuse. no angle to attack. <laughs> Pazzy Guy is in there, yeah. knowing where they are. Oh, noticing oh, getting a shot. Pazzy Guy gets the pick. Burns Round seven home. goes to the Firebirds. And the Firebirds are able to retake the lead. Very nice. Very good to see. I was a little bit anxious about that. I was too. Oh, it looks like Chet, we got a Blueberry Spaceship Box again. Say attack, attack, attack. I, attack. I, I think and there we go. <laughs> it, they attack. It was, I, you can't rush these things, you know? Yeah. You got to make sure that, hey, there is more time for you to do it. Because what, I mean, ultimately, when you place it down, then you can hold. Yep. But you Siege can't be too all slow. About now, the chokers on defense going, going aviator. Uh, aviator again. Mm -hmm. Didn't work out for them last time. But going a Cade Lesion, Malusi, Maestro, and Wamai. Okay. 
interesting i i i do like this comp a little bit better i do too but with with kaid it's going to be very interesting because it, it all, all it takes is just one yeah. one explosion yep. one one thing and it takes it all out and we go with that maverick who has those grenades so exactly. i think the strategy for them is blowing open not even blowing open welding open a hole yeah with that blowtorch and then throwing a grenade and destroying any sort okay. of electronics and, and then blowing and then using the ace to open it up. up yeah and i think that's a solid pick they tried to use a jaeger and it didn't work and ultimately i think it will my is a downgrade from the jaeger i i'd agree later in the round when my is a little bit more stronger and i i would say that the the aug is a stronger gun but definitely the util of a jaeger is way more powerful than a will my overall I so i think they're trying to use point blank as more of a uh offensive um off right now on is just staring at something yeah, right now <laughs> and while they are still getting ready yeah. still putting up reinforcements so far quizby is going one and four blue phoenix two and six ice helix eleven and five policy guy ten and four papa plus two and four and for the chokers point blank four and seven mama's got a beard three and five nice aim six and five uh roman numerals seven and five and ross Mewson three and four i think that's good good i mean the firebirds definitely have some two prompt the i mean the firebirds are playing their roles well yeah we got those entry fraggers who are trying to rush in get those initial kills um we got the people who are using their utility more and ultimately their communication must be on point because sure. even if you're if you're not getting any kills you need to be well and it's not even their fault they're just playing more communication style they're playing supportive and that's yeah. what i do when i play is i play more supportive because ultimately you have those utilities that can be game changing it's half the game it's half the battle it's just how you use your utility it's not all about kills i agree it's about how to set it like you want to play objective that's the overall thing it's not always a death oh bluefin is getting the first kill onto rust music oh but it's followed up by Posse Guy. Very nice to see. It looks like they're going to be pushing the nice main stairs. Up. Yeah, the main stairs. They know somebody's on that left, but Posse Guy is turning their back. Unfortunately, Ooh, it's, a 4v, it's a 5v2 all of a sudden. I didn't even realize that. There goes a Nomad charge. Defenders cannot go outside that doorway or else they're going to get blasted by that air jab. I see looks doing some pre-fires in some normal locations for the chokers to hold. For anybody to hold really but there goes papa plans placing there down those, those go. charges going to open up that got wall there's not much they can do there is not much the chokers can do from preventing it now the fibers have perfect line of sight wow lawless on the fire wow brother. that was a be that was that's what we like to see exactly how they that is that was beautiful to see and and that's what we expect from the firebird that is exactly strong what we expect. attack strong as it strong attacks <laughs> sometimes are better with defense but that was great to see mm -hmm. they they know how to pre how the chokers are yeah. gonna hold it and they just let them not do it and we've seen for two rounds and i think the the chokers have finally realized to not go that point yeah um and going, going over to trophy going over to trophy <laughs> which is gonna be interesting to see going a mute malusi bandit Ooh. frost and a rooney mute smart and having that mute and that bandit is good very smart because you have more coverage so and in two different ways to deny exactly. them opening up the wall however the strategy we've been using with maverick though has not you failed can't counter it has you can't, not there's failed. there's literally no way to counter it outside of a bandit or a jaeger or a wamai or just kill it but them. even then it's like if quizby charges the grenade long enough mm -hmm. burning out that fuse and then throwing it and it almost seems like an impact grenade it's there's nothing they can do yeah, well, and, and what I'd love to see last round, I'll, I'll say this for, for Quisby, is that using their Osa shield for that intel and for uh, li like a, a hybrid uh, attacker and also like a like a Montane, um, th that was just great. It tricked the defenders out, and I think that's what, what got us a lot of the kills. Like Ice Helix just backing Quisby up. Like it was just frag after frag. I love seeing that. That was so cool to see. I agree. Um, Rasmussen putting those mute charges on the main stair and just making sure that any drones and any like they're just denying any sort of entry mm -hmm. from drones, which Very is really hard. key. But also like, you know, it, 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 that's that's how you play mute. Do you focus on doorways or do you focus on 
um, uh, reinforcements. Reinforcements, because those mute can can deny any sort of electro, any sort yeah. of uh, hard breach. Or you can case. do a hybrid of both. You could uh, do a little bit of doorways, a little bit on on the walls, and it's just good to knock out that intel and knock out uh, anything trying to br breach. Here we go. And the fire ants swing their push in. Again, I should just focus on the fire birds. It's just easier. <laughs> uh -huh. and we, that, that's the people who we really want to see. <laughs> a little I, bit. I like biased. to see the chokers every once in a while. <laughs> I think it's great to see. Um, but ultimately, we are, you know, wearing their jersey. Yeah. You're wearing it. <laughs> There's not much we can do. They pay our bills. <laughs> they pay our bills. <laughs> <laughs> they keep me crazy. I mean, <laughs> sorry. <laughs> We're just a little bit of crazy. A little bit. Just the perfect amount. But they're <laughs> trying to push into um, master bedroom right yeah. there and using, using those drones using though, what like you'd see. They know they nobody nobody they know nobody's in there. Um this kind of And then there. ultimately we're gonna have that that Maverick um that Maverick Ace combo that's just gonna open up a lot of line of sight. And we and see. And I feel it's doing a really oh. nice Mama's got a, beer, got a little, uh, a little bit of damage. A little bit, little, 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 little bit of damage. damage. <laughs> now it looks like they know that. Oh, that Lucy trap! But Quisby falling. That's gonna be really, really bad for the Firebirds because they no longer have that shield to to defend them when yeah. they're pushing in. It's gonna be tough. So they're gonna have to rely on getting. They know somebody's on stairs. I think. Oh, oh but I'm just looking at a beautiful fire. headshot. That wow. was beautiful. They still know somebody there. Oh, there's a guy falling. Not out yet. Oh, uh, yeah, I know. was supposed but to. But I'm still that. getting a pick on that 4711. Bluefin is trying to make that push, not noticing somebody's right, right. there He's immediately to the, to the right. right of the doorway. He's to the right. Oh, no, he's not. <laughs> there goes a nomad uh, air jab. Papa Plask. Papa Plask is there. Pop, pop. They've opened the wall. It's great to see. Ice Helix. Nice down. Helix. Get up. Nice Helix falling. Fiber is at the disadvantage right now. Oh, oh, fire! But it, Papa Plus got Papa Plus. Yeah, Papa. Yes. Oh, oh come, come on, Papa. Papa, come on, Papa. Twenty-five seconds, and he's got the diffuser. Where is, where is Rasmussen? Where is he? Uh oh, in trophy room. Fifteen seconds on the clock. Come on, Papa. Papa. Come on, Papa. Papa. Oh, Papa. oh no! Papa. This is not Papa. looking good. This is not Papa. looking good. Papa. Papa. This is not looking good. Five. Four, Four three, three, two, two, one. No. Oi. Oh. Operators, you have run out of time. Hey, Papa got a 2K. That Pop was cool. Got a 2K. <laughs> Open. Oh, we got Ops again. Good job, guys. Thank you so much. Woo! <laughs> we got a random camera angle. We love to Ooh. see it. Round ten. This is a close match. Yeah. This that is closer than I was expecting. I think the Firebirds. Spring break kind of yeah. got to them. They need to breathe just a little bit. But that last round was a reminder is that it's not over till it's over. Mm -hmm. Is that we got two rounds to win this. So hopefully. And this is only map one. Yeah, this is only this map is one. This is only map one. We got a whole nother map. We got, a whole we got maybe two more maps after this. So let's hope just one. Let's hope just one more. But hopefully for our favor. <laughs> <laughs> All but right. The the chokers on defense this time going well they were on defense last time going dining room kitchen running a castle mute bandit kate and jaeger strong 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 i think they have they have that double down oh they have double electricity and a mute again though we have that, that oh map, triple triple we got mute we, wow well, mute's probably gonna focus on the doorways at this point yeah but, but what's interesting you want Oh, go. Oh, what did you? Oh, sorry. I was going to say, do you want to commit to that, though? Because that's I, like. I don't think so. I, I, I wouldn't want that. It, it, it's just that you could use another op. You can use another op that would be a little bit more beneficial, exactly. maybe even a, like, like. At a some Walmart. point, there's nothing more you can do. Because it, you can electrify it, but we have a Twitch. We have a Kali. Mm -hmm. so we got rid of the map. If we keep switch. this comp, we have a hard, um, hard counter. To the yeah. cop right now, to the choker's cop. I, I do like the mindset though, because first floor in that dining and kitchen, it's very hard to push in because there's only a few doorways to do so. Um, but also there's top down, is that uh the firebirds could break everything upstairs mm -hmm. with that Zofia and just just look down where it wouldn't make a difference if they had 
the mute, the uh, the bandit, or the Kaid. Mm -hmm. So it's going to be very interesting to see how the Firebirds are going to push this and how the um, go. how the Chokers are going to do this. Prep wow. phase. We're going to go to the Chokers POV. Yeah, I want to. I want to. I want to see what they're doing. This we're going to get in the mind of a Choker. Let's mind, get in we're going to be Grace Harbor students. My producer just made a joke saying, "Yes, we have a Twitch. We wouldn't be streaming if we didn't." <laughs> and suddenly I oh, regret no. it because guess what? We switched off of a Twitch. We go. We're, I see this is going Finca right now. Oh wow! Pause guy going back to Maverick. I think noticing that they're on the first floor and Kali just that that well, I forget the ex, the proper term for it, but that that grenade that Kali can fire out of the underbarrel, doing any basically acting as the EMP. It, don't don't you call it a lance or something? I think it's a lance. Um. But I think it's like a thermal lance for some Something reason. Something like that. But it's it's not. Cool. There's not yeah. much line of sight on this point for the Firebirds, so I think Kali's an interesting pick. Hold up, hold up. What was that? Whoa! I I swear I just saw that he placed a cave trap in the middle of the wall. Oh, these are strategies Maybe. that I, I, don't know. Just, I, I don't even know how to comment. Some of these strategies, I'm like, okay. It's interesting. I yeah. I, I I like it. I, I like seeing a change of the pace of the meta and having some something original. Now, yeah, so it looks going like, in from that side room, memorial room, uh, scoping it out with that drone. So mute, the mute jammers nowhere to be found, though. She's on point. Yeah, where are the mute jammers? Is, oh, Pazzi got taking a little bit of damage from somebody. But 4 7 11. Point Quizby getting the early pick on point blank is going to be really beneficial. Oh, now they don't have to worry about that. Now we're getting in the audio thing again. This is. We got a whole new audio weird. setup now, so we are having some. Oh, God, we can still. It should be good for you. <laughs> Hopefully, maybe you might hear not hear the audio. And if not, we'll probably fix that at our break between maps. But oh, nice aim getting that pick on Ice Helix. I think it might be a client uh, yeah. problem. Siege has been really glitchy since the beginning of this new season. Yeah. Which is really unfortunate. Th this glitch we haven't seen for a while, but I do remember like uh, year four, year five, this happened like a lot. But there's Pazzi guy using the same strategy that we've seen before. Hopefully, oh, Papa! Pazzi, Papa getting a pick on that mute, which is going to be really, really good. Now it's a 4v3. Oh, no! Oh, guy blowing himself up! Oh no, he's not gonna no. happen with that. But we see him. No, that would have been so good to open up, but now they can't. Now I they have Claymores still. Still have faith. We have Quizby, Blue Phoenix, and Papa still alive. Oh, yeah, Blue Phoenix is no longer alive. Oh, now Quizby Papa. Papa getting that pick. It is a two v two right now. Quizby making their way up. Oh, but but can't. Quizby is trapped by castle. Manual oh. override oh. on that castle barricade. Oh. Get your workout, Pop! Oh, we're getting a triple! Come on for the triple! Quad, oh, he's got quad, the triple! Quad, 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 pop, 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 plant, pop, pop, plant, pop, pop, plant, pop, 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 plant, is planting, pop, planting, pop, pop, planting. Two seconds. We'll be shooting. We'll be taking. We'll be holding. Damage on nice. Pop, planting. Pop, running. Pop is planted. And pop is red. Pop, reloading. Pop, claymoring. Pop, claymore. Papa popping a play a claymore. But the uh -oh. new jammer, Papa struggling. I did. I forgot oh. about that. Oh, he I takes it out. Oh, taking a little bit of damage to something. Probably that electricity up there's that electricity. Twenty. The quiz is in a uh -oh. fight. It's a one v one right now. Twenty seconds on the diffuser. Papa 19. has got this. I don't think they know where the bomb is. I don't yet. think they do. I don't think they do. I don't think they do. Oh, they know it. Oh, they, they know found it. it. They found it. Oh, oh. There's nothing he can do. He's having to go. Not enough time. Come on, Papa. Papa. Yeah. Papa. Quad. Quad. He got yes. Quad. He got Quad kill. Let's go, Papa. Papa, Papa clutch. <laughs> Papa clutch. It. Oh. Wow. What? That could have. That was one kill away from the ace. As ace. Love it. Ace. ace. Papa Plot. I, I want to interview him now. We're gonna we're gonna interview Papa Plot. <laughs> I'm gonna say that right now. Everyone in chat. Mark my words, Papa Plots. Papa Plots. 
put that in chat. Somebody clip I that want, too. I wonder. Somebody, you... Well, I'm sure he's going to be saving that entire match. I hope so. <laughs> that was a beautiful clutch. Uh, match point for the Firebirds. If the Firebirds win this round, map one goes to them. If the Chokers win, no, oh, still go to match point. Yeah, sorry. I was thinking we we're gonna have to go into extra, yeah. extra innings, as we may call it. We get a uh, safe round right here, and we do get another one next round. So, hopefully, we can just end it here. That hopefully. that is the uh, the goal. And here's the key: Chokers are going on the point that did not work out for them. So <laughs> I'm confident now. We know how to counter them at this point. We've seen it numerous times. So sure. I'm confident. Wow, look at Ice Helix with 16 kills. Posse guy, 11. Papa was seven. Papa Blue Phoenix, seven three, and Quisby right with now. two. But Quisby having the most assists out of the Firebird so far. Playing a very good operator. Very good. Oh, so now, great. we can see on the Chokers, they have one top fragger, and it's very clear. Nice aim going 12 mm -hmm. and 8 right now. Everybody else going a little bit, quite a bit less. Uh, 4, 7, 11 there. In Roman numerals, I don't know what to call it. If, if, I don't know. Uh, Sports 7 Eleven, I'm going to say that. But, um, <laughs> but, but it's interesting because they're also playing Bandit. Mm -hmm. um, so it's either they're going to have to Bandit trick or they're going to have to focus on uh, on Frags. Oh, and well, but that being said, though, like again, we're pulling out that Maverick. That Maverick yeah. doesn't have to worry about electricity. It's oh they're they're going full on they're they're throwing every one my trap they can on that wall. <laughs> it's interesting watching this without any audio. <laughs> it is. <laughs> it's like a. We hope you have audio, Twitch viewers. We just don't. Oh, looks like but. Blueberry Spaceship uh, just said they're pulling out so many cell phones. I think they must be Gen <laughs> Z. Yeah, I love it. I love it. Yes, best generation. Great joke. <laughs> I let it admit. Oh, but Quizby almost getting almost jumping oh. up and getting picked. Off, but wow, that defense. Did, you, did you see that? Quisby broke the lines yes. inside to her shield and put a uh, a claymore down. Ponzi guy getting a wow, despite all of those who want my trap. Or Toby getting that early. Oof. Oh my god, he wanted to redeem really himself from last. Oh, yeah, uh, the last time. It, huh? it was like, I'm not gonna do it again. I am not gonna be there. There's known that Thunderbird trap the right behind that... Quisby, though. Hopefully, Quisby can get it. Oh killed. no, but nice him getting that C4 in revenge. But Blue Phoenix oh, falling, no. but Quisby getting the refrag. It is now a 3v3 right I'll now. Out. And Blue Phoenix getting another Whoa. double kill. What's Papa doing? Do? What's Papa doing? Come on, Papa. Ice Felix knows somebody's in library. As long as that, as long as Ice Felix can keep it. Papa's planting. Papa plant. Papa plant. Yeah, like what you said of Ice Helix. And we're planted. So now we just have seconds. to hold it. There goes another Claymore. Two Claymores at play right now. This... The Firebirds is probably taking a, a little bit of damage trap. from something. But I gotta be honest, the only two people for the chokers are not even on point. Yeah. They do a tap second. Point. Oh, oh they know Pop Pop is getting lighting him up. up. Oh no. Not enough falling. But down to 50. Ice Helix! Getting the frame. And now Quisby is just it's holding behind it. Yes! Get it. Map one going Fire for the Bird. Firebirds. Take him out. Beautiful to see. <laughs> Pop was a clutching Pop a clutch. Beautiful to see the fire going nice. seven and four. I'm Joker's did better than I, I, I'm. I'm. That's that's pretty good. It's they are great. great opponent to see. Great so opponent, far. opponent to see. This Papa teaching really kids fun. a lesson. Yes. Thank you, Anger Sa Anger Sa Anger's Anger Saya Anger Anger Saya. So whatever. So that was sorry. beautiful to see. <laughs> that was Fireman's great. getting map one, map two going to clubhouse, and we Woo! clubhouse. That is our map. That point. is the map. So, so we're hopefully the Firebirds can bring it home right here. But this has been so much fun so far with the Chokers. But are we gonna go on a little break? We're gonna go on a, I think a five minute break. Five yeah, minute. just a little bit of a bathroom break. You know, I'm gonna talk to oh, everybody, to see breathe. how they feel, <laughs> and hopefully we can get some of these audio issues fixed. Hopefully you're not experiencing that. Hopefully it's just us. But we will be back in about five more minutes. So we'll, we'll see, see you in a then. bit. I want you 
can be. Like you trying to get stuck in it. Gotta get it, uh. Future on the horizon, so do we. It's really just the greatest college experience I could have asked for. What really drew me in was having an adventure. I think something really unique about Carthage is that it constantly pushes you outside of your comfort zone. At Carthage College, we will push you to dive deep, to channel your curiosity, and excel in your chosen field. like an individual journey through collaborative effort. And so overall, this has been my college experience, but so many people that I've met have been supportive along the way, and they're all looking out for you. So that's really why it feels like a family. As you ignite your true potential and start asking the hard questions, you'll find the answers are just the beginning. That's the moment your purpose comes into view. We are really able to get great one-on-one -on -one action with our professors. So you can't hide in your classroom. You're always actively participating. You'll get recommended for things that you might not have ever been interested in before, and you end up realizing that that might be your passion. Everyone here is just so nice, so welcoming. It's really easy to make friends here at Carthage. The biggest change was going from student to young business professional. I love Carthage. It's definitely the people. Living on the lake is amazing. I feel very prepared for my future. Ended up surpassing my expectations. Some things you just need to see for yourself. Come take a closer look at Carthage College.
we are back after a little bit of a break in between maps. Uh, good news and bad news, Tony. Oh, what? Let's do so, the bad news first. Bad news is the audio issues on Villa were happening for our players too. Oh. Our players were having our, so many audio issues, not knowing where certain things were happening. And audio is very important for this game, so they yeah. struggled. And like there were a few rounds where they were talking, where they they said the reason we won that, where we lost that round, was yeah. because we couldn't hear. Uh, good news, reportedly that's only happening on the maps that we have that are in the new team deathmatch game mode. And okay. Clubhouse is not. Okay, so, so let's hope that doesn't happen this time around. Let's hope. I am confident it won't. We'll experience it with you. But apparently that is an issue siege wide, not just our stream here tonight. Well, so that, we apologize for that's that. That's a good thing because I, I remember this bug being around year five, year six, is that it, it, it was a bug that happened for a very long time where it would rotate your audio either 90 degrees or fully. Mm -hmm. And no, that's, and, and the devs know what to yeah, do. The I was talking with exactly I was talking with Quisby, and there was one time where they breached into vault. And the, and uh, Pilot Plot oh, and Quisby yeah. said we never heard that. That sounded like it was on the other side of the room, and that is crucial information that hurt them. Yeah, because they, they couldn't get. That was so, a very strong breach too. Yeah. That was the one that was. That dead. was the one that was like, okay, now Clubhouse should be fixed. And Clubhouse should be better go. because it's not a GDM. And also, we have a substitution for none other than Thermometer. Oh wow, Thermometer is back. Oh, As you know, no. Thermometer is. Just an a amazing wild player, a wild card. You never know what to expect from him. And ultimately, we're going to see some interesting it's plays from be him. Inter oh, but it also looks like we got some people in chat. We got, Ang oh wait, uh, Blueberry Spaceship Box uh, saying again, is the shield Quisby hiding behind for the final kill only a one-way window? No. No, it is a two-way window. <laughs> but uh, it, it, it's it's a very interesting uh oh they banned oh, osa there they, osa. they <laughs> didn't want to do with it anymore there you go but yeah <laughs> it is completely see-through unless as you saw quizby hit it and it shattered yeah. so nobody could see through it um and that but the mira though if we do see a mira that is one way that is one way. that is one way um, but it's pretty sure in i'm sh pretty sure in like lore they're made by the same both are made by mira but oh going for a nomad Ooh. ban a nomad osa so thatcher wow. and jackal are completely open and since the firebirds are attacking okay. that's gonna be very powerful for them that we might actually see strong. a thatcher we might see a thatcher oh on this map that is that is so to have. that is bad on the, the chokers. wow that is bad for the chokers there uh, that's that's really, and really, really and they're, tough. so they're banning Mira. There you go. It's smart to have target bans. Cade. They're gonna ban Cade. They're gonna ban that's Cade. Cade. That's like hmm. they're gonna ban Cade. This is the token. No, I'm gonna go with mute. I'm feeling it. I hope it's mute. I'm ban. feeling it in the I air. hope it's mute ban, but also like they played mute oh. and they're defending. So it's a Valk. Oh, wow, Valk again. Valk is better on this map, I'd say. I think Cade's better. Uh, Oh, is so we got we, we got a new person so, in chat. We got M82 saying M82, hello. M82, How's it going? M82. Welcome to the stream. Welcome to the stream. <laughs> Happy to see you. So, Firebirds are attacking. Going CCTV room for the chokers. Yeah. And a Tachanka. Which is solid hold. Very solid. It's like the best. It's it's everybody. Love it. No. For the first time. No, man. we're not gonna talk about that because attack a repick. I don't want it. I don't want to get my hopes up. So I'm we'll getting my later. hopes up. We're gonna see a Thatcher. <laughs> I see this is playing Thatcher. Thatcher having EMP grenades that can just disable any electronics mm. through a wall. Crazy. So, so different for this game. Um, especially on Clubhouse. They won without. Yeah. So. Oh, we got some more people in chat. We got. <laughs> so Blueberry Spaceship. Yeah, they had some weird audio. Sometimes they didn't hear things. Sometimes they heard it from the other side of the room. And um, little mill 53, awesome gameplay, Firebirds. So, for sure. Anyways, back to the game. <laughs> Sorry, we love interacting. We, we, Is so, coach in chat? I don't I don't know. Maybe. 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 Coach is floating around. But, so the defenders, going to be some interesting picks. Uh, I saw a Chachanka. The Chachanka. And they're going, so the defenders going Jaeger, Chachanka, Mute, Smoke, and Cade. Cade's going to be good. But again, we have a Thatcher. We have a Thatcher. Thatcher's going to Lion. I told you. I saw oh, like this no. to Lion. We ha we're doing that pot that Maverick Ace trick, which is good. Oh. Thermometer's <laughs> going. We get the wild though. card going. Oh, oh this is gonna be so good game. to see. Oh. I almost want to spectate only him. I almost want to, but 
We'll see. We'll see. Yeah. Where oh, wait, Thatcher? Papazi guy swapping out Maverick for Thatcher. Thatcher. There we go. Okay. We're finally seeing Thatcher here. But I love the, old the, the Lord in game. The Lord Tachanka. The man, the myth. And the, the round has started. So Thermometer going from Blitz to Ace. Or, oh, no, no, no. From, <laughs> bl from Blitz to Glass. I'm like, what did I say wrong? I was like, I was I was like, like yeah. hold up. Going glass, and I know thermometer is a. Is, and here glass. we go. Let's see Posy guy so, with the EMP. I think this is going to be really fun to see. Now glass having a a DMR, almost like a sniper rifle, but a little less powerful. Um, and uh, also can see through smoke. Can see through smoke. <laughs> highlights bright yellow. Any enemies? Mm hmm. And as we're going to see here, there you go. There goes. They the have all, they have the wall open. So. But it looks like we are having that audio glitch again this map. Uh, oh, wow. Well, I don't think we're having any audio in this case, which is change of pace. Audio is yeah. broken in this game, apparently. So hopefully it's fixed by next week. Oh, okay. We heard the lion scan oh, there. I guess which... we can get you to. Oh, oh, the fireman's getting the Lord the is down. Is so good to see. That was scary. But what a, a refrag on the Pazzi guy. No, with the Lord down, there's no more Shamihas to be launched. Shamihas are fire grenades for Tachanka. And content is all huge crowd control ability. Huge crowd control. Now, this is Where's Thermometer? There's Thermometer. Taking from that the warehouse, which you just never see. Oh, holding I the angle. Like I see it. Give me that pick. I want to spectate. I see it. There's that lion scan again. Being used, Second highlighting one. anybody that moves. When it's sending out some pulses, it's a very annoying ability, but great for very crowd annoying. control. And we got Jackal here looking for footprints. Oh my gosh. Attackers have located Move a, a little bit more. <laughs> I, I was like, you're going to see them, right? But I feel like they pick a nice aim. They have B pretty much secured. Like, they yeah. just need to go in and plant. And as we're going to see, Thermometer oh. going from below, which is interesting to see. But Quizby oh, getting Quizby. lit up. Doing a lot of damage, but there's only one person left for the chokers. Getting that. Uh oh. Ooh. Ooh. Quizby is down, but not out so far. Here we go. Here's four to say. Here, here we go. Thermometer, thermometer is back. Getting that kill. <laughs> they went. <laughs> thermometer was like, I need to get a kill tonight. <laughs> if I don't get a kill in this round, it'll be all for nothing. It'll be all for nothing. Very good first round for the Firebirds. Very strong. And just to let the uh, chokers know how strong they are on attack. And it looks like almost the same strat. Oh, we got it. There's an Aruni for There's the chokers. Aruni. So the chokers going Kaid, Smoke, Aruni. The Chanka, the Lord. The Chanka and Jaeger. Um, and the Firebird is going Glaz, Ace, Thatcher, Finca, and Jackal. Very strong. That's, that's that's a pick I never thought I'd see in a million years. The glass? No, just going Thatcher. Oh yeah. Jackal. <laughs> it is the chokers thought we couldn't play anybody but Os Osa and Nomad, but it's the comp that everybody so wants but can never have. Yeah. Oh, and we got a uh, first time chatter. We got straight shifty. I dig the college ad break, but I wish the ad featured someone hitting a mad. We're gonna take a break from it. We're just gonna. We're just gonna do the we're just gonna, uh, the we're bearded gonna, man and toner. Gonna that. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna make sure that the ads are only us. Yeah. <laughs> and M eight to I feel like switching from Finca to Ash. Good. I think that's uh, uh, back to A or back to Ash. No, from Finca to Ash. There we go. <laughs> it's, it's very strong. Having like a <laughs> pretty much our top frag on almost every single match. Going one of the Five, most three, top frag heavy operators in the entire game with a lot of explosive power it's it's just smart now it's i want to see i want to see what i want to see what glass is going to put out what thermometer is going to do um seeing that the chokers are on the same point whether or not they'll adapt that strategy we'll see yeah it's going to be pause the guy here probably going to throw out another the, one what do the chokers it, expect it takes only one to get it done mm -hmm. No hassle, no fuss. <laughs> That's why he's banned all the time. Yeah, it, is, it is just not. It's just easy with Thatcher, it's you know? It's so easy. And with Glass just up on the rooftops, it's just like there's nothing 
that the defenders can do. Ice Helix is pinging angle. somebody on rafters. They know that there's two people in garage right now, but he's able to push in just a little bit oh. because they've opened up the garage doors. Did not. Oh, point blank is down. Pause the guy. Take Laz the can thermometer can see somebody's behind that shield waiting for them just to poke up. But nice Whoa! on rafters falls to Papa Plonsk. And it looks like Garage is going to be held. There is a bulletproof camera, though, and they've opened up a nice hole on Garage. So maybe it's going to be they're going to have better line of sight. Yeah, these we'll are see. these are great angles so far. The fire Frisbee's attacking from the central subroof. Yeah, the so far the chokers. This are game just, is so different when you can't hear. Anything. I know. I, so I hate like, it. It's so less energetic, less chaotic, and it's just like. It's just like when you're like uh, when you're in a sports bar and you're trying to watch a game, yeah. but you, there's no audio. Papa Flans getting that pick on four seven eleven. Whoa! There's another this one by the guy. Guy wow. having a triple it kill. It is a flawless, flawless round two. two. Wow! Insane. That was. It's really good. The only thing I can't get energetic when there's I no know. noise. I'm just like I didn't because like I tough. can't tell when there's firefights. Oh, if we're not viewing it, we can't tell. We got Steph Parsons four two three saying, "Let's go thermometer." Oh yeah, <laughs> love to love to see it. Love we to see love the seeing the wild card. We love seeing thermometer. It's just such a good play. Oh, this time they're choosing basement. They're, they're choosing basement and are going an oryx. You do not see oryx. You don't see oryx. That's such an interesting pick. We're going to see how nice same plays Oryx. Mm -hmm. Oryx has the special ability of running, running <laughs> through walls really fast and breaking in, breaking holes through walls. Yeah. Or you could run into people running into people. And, but that's not just typical. But usually, like, if you're running at somebody, they could just, you know, yeah. shoot you. Like, <laughs> it's an interesting pick. Uh, really good for creating holes in walls. Mm hmm. It takes a little bit of damage while doing so. It's a little bit of damage. But at the same time, it's a very in interesting champ and, and has one of the best guns in game. Yeah. Also, Legion's gun. So it's a very good SMG. But I, my prediction is Oryx wow, is going to be defending attack. first floor so the Firebirds can't do a top down. Mm -hmm. Now, it looks like, too, we can see that he's opening up on second floor, oh. opening up from that hatch. So I think what's going to happen okay. is this Oryx is going to make sure that the Firebirds cannot breach through the kitchen hatch. Ten seconds left before which, or he, he may be defending up in top floor and, and then just looking down from there. This is going to be very interesting to see. Yeah. Oh, it looks like we oh, got odds. Uh, oh, thing. nice aim's going for the, the, oh, the wall no. peak. Which, yeah, when this the, when this map was reworked a long, long time ago, this is the one thing that the uh, the devs did not tweak was I, this really stupid angle. It's there's that is such a bad angle. Yeah, they need to fix that because it's just like you can't, you know, you're you supposed to kind it. of feel safe outside in a sense, but yeah. You know, it's 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 well, almost like a that's our way of tower. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. One of the worst maps in the game. Yeah. To some people. I love it. <laughs> I agree. Oh, oh no. Rath are getting the pickup. Papa. No. Now Papa. the Firebirds don't have any hard breach, which ultimately, I mean, basement. You kind of need to go without hard breach. You can. You I, can yeah, go. It's a bit I think of all the maps. Two stairwells. Yeah. Um, but it does. It does help if you're pushing down main stairs. Which I think Quizby might be trying to do, trying to open up a little bit. Posy guy going into central hallway right now, and thermometer in the oil pit. So that's a very nice thing. I think. Oh, he, but Posy guy getting oh, that pick. It's all tied up. A nice name. So oh, we have a rumor. Thermometer. I need to go to thermometer's cam. We got thermal cam here. We got thermometer cam. Yeah, in the gas. In the smoke. In the gas pit. It's a very. It's very strong having a therm or not a glass <laughs> in there. <laughs> Watching, just waiting. Oh, oh no! Oh, a lot of damage happening to the fibers there. But Posy guys is able to very get the pick, nice. and it's just thermometer. But there's the Chanka. It's Tachanka who's just Shumiha. Shumi has left and right. <laughs> I love it. I like their recommendation in chat, making the gunshot noises and the breach noises. Oh so yeah, can, yeah. All right, we're going to do pause guy. We're going to see pause guy. Okay. Pause it. Oh, no. The thermometer getting the pick. Here we go. Here we go. Oh, wait. Boom. Boom. 
<laughs> Reload. <laughs> and we got some people in chat. Oh we got AP Parsons, Thermometer, Iron, Fire, M18. Let's go. And Mugen, you get, oh, Jordy. Said that. <laughs> Little Mill, this team is on fire. We are fired up. And fired up. Firebird. Yes, caster sound effects. Let's try it. I like we'll it. We'll give it a shot. Okay. Okay. <laughs> okay. Right. Here's an interesting pick from the Chokers. Captain. Nice aim. Knowing that Oryx <laughs> is not a good roamer. Going Cav. Chooses. Cav is, I think, a better roamer. Yes. However, we got a jackal. Yes. <laughs> it's the direct the counter direct to counter to Caviera. Caviera having a really, really powerful pistol mm -hmm. that can down people in like one or two shots. Yeah, her pistol, a headshot, downs them. Instead of instantly taking them out, downs them so she can interrogate, which is her ability. Interrogation. Basically, what it means is that you go you go in there, it takes a few seconds to wind up, and you get the intel on where all the attackers are. Are all of their locations live for about eight eight to ten seconds, about. And she can she also has silence step. So mm -hmm. you cannot hear when she's coming up behind you to give you a little Which we're having audio issues, so I don't think yeah, we're here. that's gonna be a problem. Uh, uh, we'll make the little noises. Do, 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 do. Step, 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 step. Sneak, sneak, sneak. That's kind of fun. I'm gonna. I want to. Oh, oh, oh. I'm gonna, gonna do it until. Uh, <laughs> step, step. Jump, Alter, leap. Why are we saying what she's doing? <laughs> <laughs> what? What? I'll, I'll, I'll do. The, I'll do the voice acting. You do that. I don't like it. No, we're not gonna do it. I'm gonna do it. And so coach now they're doing the do it. <laughs> coach is gonna come in here and be like, what are you doing? Uh our producer's not here to make fun of us though, so <laughs> you know, Shaddy's been real quiet recently too, so I'm glad that oh, both both of them are out of our hair. I, I don't know. I don't know who Shaddy is, uh he's a secret person. <laughs> but it looks like they're pushing through construction. But here's the interesting thing. There's a bunch of people right there. So if we get this open, yeah. we can just lay into the fire. Oh wow. Ooh, how's the oh, guy repelling? Guy. Trying to get that angle through construction. Very sharp. Oh, 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 missing all the shots. I'm missing all of them. <laughs> Almost. <laughs> Just a little bit to the right. Down to 50. Where's thermometer? There's thermometer. The thermometer you know, it's playing. weird not seeing thermometer play shield ops. I know. Normally, I mean, we were about to see a blitz, but like. I, I think they like to switch it up every once in a while. You know? Some. I mean, we had teams target ban thermometer recently. <laughs> yeah. So, you know, they just. Shit. There's no winning. Smoke. Boop. Boop. Broke. Repel. Getting the pick. First kill Get goes to the pick. Firebirds. Shoot. Shoot. Boop. I'm, I'm definitely gonna sound of things. I am <laughs> going to. I'm gonna continue. Oh, I want to be a right, one. Gonna, it looks now. like they're gonna open up bathroom, which is gonna be a really good angle for them. Choo. Using that second Selma charge. <laughs> Boom. Kaboom. <laughs> Stop. Seriously. No. Uh, we're gonna lose viewers because of that. We're gonna lose viewers. Pop applause. Good angle. Holding that angle. Left. That is a really so good angle. Far. But there's plenty. Yeah, there's Shumiha. Oh, but Ponzi guy, where's Ponzi guy? There's Ponzi guy. Knowing that somebody's on fire, missing the shots on the cap, but getting, getting a cap that was out of the way. That was it's beautiful. It's their mom and Ponzi guy. Come on, come on. Can he get the eight? Come on, come on. Quad. Quad. No. Their mom is stealing the eight. Really? We've had two <laughs> players get four Ks now. But a flawless round. Flawless round. Here are the Love stats. It. This is gonna be great to see. This we got is a little champion, little champion, champion team. team. I'm happy Thank to see you. We are top of the division for the Rainbow Six Siege right now in the NECC. Love and it. we're going to playoffs for for the uh, Oh let's go. Oh, but Cavs Silent Fist doesn't leave footprints. I agree. That yeah. is another thing we forgot to say. Cav does not leave footprints when she's using silent stuff. Not only so silent can scan it. But also, like, we didn't see Jackal scans really that all that round, so. Yeah, Caviera, there, there was not a lot of roaming to no. do for the Firebirds no. in general, so Caviera was kind of pointless in that one. I agree. And I think, I mean, at that point, there's so many angles to attack. Mm -hmm. Don't It's almost like don't even bother with a roamer. But it looks like the Chokers are going to go basement for this round. And we're seeing a Goyo. 
we're gonna talk we're gonna see that goyo rework we were talking about earlier that's gonna be very 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 strong but i i believe in the firebirds they have shown i us believe we I know clubhouse clubhouse is our map as they can. clubhouse is our map i believe i can touch fly. this guy that's no no hang on hang on i, I believe, believe i can fly. fly i believe i can touch the chokers Nope. Nope. <laughs> no. Sounded better in my head. <laughs> you didn't tell me you were going to do that. Here's that Goyo, though. Here are, is that Goyo trap placing those gas canisters in key areas. Those are good just spots. Just to deny it. But here's the weird thing. Using that gas canister right there, Firebirds can shoot it. Yeah. Oh, but be yeah, oh out. never mind. <laughs> oh, but Rasmussen taking so much damage. Oh, no. Hang on, what's, what happened? Where's the button? Where's the button? What? Oh, we got M8 Tomb saying the angles they're taking are smart. They are very smart, especially the pre fires. They've been. Oh, they're taking fire. What are the chokers doing? Two people just took so much damage from something. Uh, it, it, is it against their own teammates? Or? I think so. I think they're oh, activating no. the Goyo traps. Oh, and no. Burning. We can't tell because we don't have audio. <laughs> But oh, here's that Goyo. Oh, here's we got Goyo. We got to hide in free in kitchen freezer right now. Very interesting. Very interesting. But there's Quizby never going for the attack. <laughs> Knowing uh, opening up freezer. Uh oh. Oh wait. This might be really good for the firebird. Boop. Boop. Wait. Oh no. Oh come on. Be careful. Those are fresh feet. Noticing someone no. right there. I'm like, run, 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 get, run. Him, get him, get him, get him. No, oh, they're gone. Beep. Oh, the pun oh, guy in no. a spat. No! Will Where's someone thermometer? rescue me? Where's the thermometer? Pussy There's guy. thermometer. Holding oil pit too. Great angle on that. Very. Great angle from If he just from, had walls. He, if he just had walls, Holy he would have gotten easy kills. Ozzy guy There's still dying. Using to the those, Canadian gonna wait for those fight those everything. footprints. Shooting through kitchen. Use oh, that's a good strategy. That is good. That is a really, really good strategy. No damage done, but still. Just to give it a little bit of anxiety. <laughs> the positive guys back up. Really there good. We go. Having a little bit of just a little bit of health. Probably gonna take a little bit more defensively. Found well, the, the the chokers are taking damage from so many different sources. What is happening? And the firebirds have barely even pushed in. What is happening? It, it, there might be a coup there happening. Might be a coup. There's a there's, a, there's a, a the revolt. Here's, that, not, here's nice thing. <laughs> Having just very little health right now. Gonna see. Oh, oh well, from Kappa. Right Quizby taking a little bit of damage. Little bit no. Noticing somebody's now first floor. That location has been revealed for the firebird, so they can move in. Oh, I feel it's getting a pick on four seven eleven. There is that person. Nice refrag. That was a really nice refrag. Ozzy guy. guy getting an awesome. Running out of ammo! Kill the Canadian! With the, the Canadian pistol. is down! With the pistol! It is now just 1v4! And they know! Oh! oh. Thermometer calling! No! Out. Thermometer's angry now! Uh oh! They're probably gonna be planting just to cause there. a little bit oh, of. Oh no! Chaos. They're planting! Ice Helix! Three seconds, two seconds to stick, one second, and we got 45 seconds on the clock. Diffuser is planted. Papa Plants get 25 health, and Ice Helix about 75. Or, uh, wait, 105. <laughs> I can't man. Okay. Rasmussen is going upstairs. Probably going to drop so some chicken hat. Okay, that is... But Ice Helix knows their know. strategy. 23 seconds. This is going to be really tight. It's going to be interesting to see. Where's Papa? There's Papa. <laughs> Literally every angle. Hey, Papa, I know it. You know, I feel like Papa. Papa, Papa puts the kill. All of the angles on that hat. If there's anything that's coming. That is great. Look at him. I love oh. seeing the rag doll. Oh my God. I His love legs it. just I collapse. Love it. Round six. Firebird oh. going 5-0 and right now. And in chat, we get a uh, straight shift. He says, cast of the year. Thank you so much. And MA2, yes, sir, agrees with the hit. Quad kill. A, 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 I can't say I can't say your name. Obs. I'm so sorry. Obs. 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 I agree. Blueberry spaceship box again. <laughs> two two rounds. Yes. Yes. And they tune. I know, right? It has been a wonderful day of siege. This has been really fun. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. It is. It's it, despite the technical difficulties that's making it really difficult. We apologize for that. That's yeah. on siege though. That's not even on us. <laughs> is it in the stream? I think it's on because they're having the same issues. Oh, up there. it is in game. And apparently I was talking to Quisby uh, between maps. 
this is just a known issue yeah. that they need to fix. And I think same happened previously, like you said. So yeah. uh, hopefully the seats the, gets the devs, the devs know this problem. Yeah. I, I, I'm very confident that in, in less than a week, this will be solved. Um, but it, it's very interesting that now we see a warden when there's no more glass. I, warden but is here's the direct counter. <laughs> I'm oh, waiting wait. for thermometer oh, to go black. Glass. We gotta see a blitz glass thermometer. Is, glass we gotta is see it. Glass is back. Never mind. I attack a repick. I I can't. <laughs> that's what I. That's why I never talk about the comps for the attackers. But we're seeing the same from the firebirds. Like we always say, if it ain't broke, don't, don't fix it. Fix it. Don't Whatever fix you it. do. But looks like there is no. Oh, there's that black ice. Oh, nice same having that so beautiful cool. gun skin. Love but it. The shotgun on Warden and not really taking the MPX. I'm not a fan of shotguns. I, I don't like the play style. I like and I think some it's of gonna them. be a little bit. Uh, I don't know. But, but Warden has a god gun, which is the MPX, which is only on Warden and Valkyrie. So I don't know why they wouldn't do okay. that. Okay, there are three people on point for the chokers and oh, four. Four people on point, but they're all holding oh. really weird angles. And Rasmussen getting that early, wherever they were. I think they're oh they were roaming. I think, I think we saw <laughs> them roaming. Taking so. them out. They know. They know. They know all these 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 places that these roamers could be hiding because they have to think like a roamer. And we have some really really good roamers on our team. So you know this audio is weird. It's uh, it, it's the same audio of when a drone gets destroyed. Yeah, yep. it's just that was something positive. But Puck oh. needed to pick a nice aim, which is gonna be really good because nice aim was the top fragger last round. And think a healing posy guy a little bit, getting him back to. 50, uh, and, ah, sorry, 45, something like that. <laughs> now, I'm going to say this, too. On the chokers, only two of them have any sort of kills. Three of the chokers don't. Yeah, they're going zero. We wow. might see another flawless here. Oh, and we get MA2. Posi guy is so good. We I agree, MA2. Here we go, thermometer. I want to see a oh, guy falling. No, there no goes flawless. flawless, unfortunately. That's okay, Posi. Here we go. I want to see. Come on. Plays. I want to see it. So you can see those bars on the side of his scopes. He oh. can only see through smoke when he's... Oh. There you go. When oh. he's standing still, those yeah. charges refill, and that allows him to see. Hopefully, people. thermometer oh, sees that Ella mine, the Gersmont mine on the There's other the side. Pop a plot. But they don't even worry about the Gersmont mine. That is mine. beautiful to see. <laughs> oh, Shady throwing some shade again. I oh. don't know why they are so you know, negative. There's a reason why they call him Shady. Galahad so could rude. never cast like these two can. Wow, that's some shade. Our producer is just laughing. Our producer is making fun of us right now. I am. You know, but our chat is on our side. Call yeah. this caster of the year, which means so much to us. <laughs> I, I think. Another Sh shady. I'm gonna. I'm gonna have. Whenever I meet Shady, I'm going. I know. Oh, thermometer's going clack. Finally. Thermometer's going clack. About time. I'm just see. This is gonna be so good. And it's match point. And if the Firebirds win this. And they're going to go flawless map. <laughs> it is going to be a flawless map, which you don't see. You rarely see. You rarely see. But it has been a great, a great day so far. I, I mean, look. Oh my, a glass and a collie. Probably not going to be locked there's in. Not, there's no. Probably way. not going to be as good as thermometer. And the fact but, but that two snipers. That's just like you never see that. No. But it's, I it's doubt. Gonna I doubt it's going to. I think one of them is going to switch again. Attack yeah. and repick. You can't even like look at these comps and be like, oh, that's what they're going to do. Yeah. Because very easily could they change. Uh oh, I think our producer is texting something to Shaddy. <laughs> I, I, I I think I think they're teaming up. I think they're teaming up. I think they're teaming it's up. It's a conspiracy. I really I a think conspiracy. Don't think the producer and, Sh and Shaddy like Galahad, and I don't understand uh, why. I think Galahad's a great person. I think Galahad's a great person as well. Yeah. I, I I wish that the that that chat can meet Galahad Attack one day. They they have, but they but the ones that haven't. One such of these a great days. guy. This producer loves Galahad, but I don't know. I don't know. I don't know. I, That's what I'm getting. With. I don't. I don't feel that though. Okay. I don't feel the love. Firebirds going on defense, not going CCTV, going bedroom and gym, which is usually a secondary pick. Usually it's CCTV, yeah. but we have a lot of success with this hold. So I, I'm, I'm not the pro, so I'm not gonna judge. <laughs> I just want to. I almost want to spectate thermometer the entire time. I'm gonna be honest, but as we can see on the chokers' oh, side, no. oh no, oh no, oh no, 
No, don't, this might be really don't, bad. Don't disrespect. This might be really bad. Oh no. Oh no. Uh oh. Oh no. Yeah. There we go. I knew it. I knew it. I I'm hate like, to say it, but thermometer, yeah. you kind of deserved it. That you can't. Was, you can't. That's just the dirty. That strategy. is dirty. I knew it was gonna be bad. But pause, you guy roaming over to cash room, and I think they're kind of giving him the thought that, hey, we're in CCTV, but we're not. We are not. So. It's unfortunate we can't see thermometer. Uh oh, oh, oh but blitz. they're a blitz. Oh no. There's that blitz. It's a gonna be been located. It's gonna be interesting to see. But Quisby is laying down some covering fire while that blitz uh charges up that flash. And hopefully it's taking a lot of damage forward. there from Quisby, though. Once that bl that blitz is gone, there you go. There's that blitz. I should just getting there that early that, that pick. And they're laying in a lot, a lot of fire of damage. to that thermite. They're doing a push from construction. My, oh, I see it's taking, taking quite a bit of damage from logistics. Down in one, they do double they, kill. He doesn't care about the damage. It does care. not affect him at all. There's Kali, though. Kali's going to run around, going to flank in. And, and there you go, three. Nice Triple Helix. kill. Wow. Helix. Where's Quizby? Where's Quizby? an ace. Where's Papa? Where's Papa? Ace. 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 I don't know where these are. Oh, my it's down. So honestly, it's just just the ying. And there goes the first ying charge. It is a 3v1 so far down, but not out. And it is, it is over. over. Just like that, the yeah. game is over. Firebirds taking club. Oh, it's this on the oh, Firebirds 2. 7 0. Oh. Map, winning map in map one and map two. Wow. Map one was a little bit scary, little but map scary. two, not a care in the world. They're just it's like, our home we turf. know this. It's our this is our map. Turf. We're going to make them regret it. And pause the guy. 14 and four. I see like seven. Oh my gosh. Oh. It's gotten up. That's it. That's it. <laughs> what a match. What a match. The great opponent. That was, that was that was really, really, really fun. That Joker really gave us good. a run for our money the first map. That was mm -hmm. really good. And even with our audio difficulties on oh both sides, it is fit. just a great day for Siege overall. I agree. Really I really time. hope we can get some sort of uh, fix for it by next week because this is like, it changes the game. Yeah. Audio is such an important thing in this game. Audio if is you can't 100%. hear anything properly, you won't know. You won't yeah. know where they are. And ultimately, you could lose because of that. Mm -hmm. But... Hopefully um, we can get that fixed. But I think we're going to take just a quick break before our game interview. We're going to find someone. We're going to have to choose who it is. I'm, I'm, I'm excited. We're going to be an industry. So we will be back in about two minutes, maybe with an interview um, coming up after these, probably an ad break. All right. <laughs> we'll see. your future on the horizon? So do we. It's really just the greatest college experience I could have asked for. What really drew me in was having an adventure. I think something really unique about Carthage is that it constantly pushes you outside of your comfort zone. At Carthage College, we will push you to dive deep, to channel your curiosity, and excel in your chosen field. like an individual journey through collaborative effort. And so overall, this has been my college experience, but so many people that I've met have been supportive along the way and they're all looking out for you. So that's really why it feels like a family. As you ignite your true potential and start asking the hard questions, 
you'll find that the answers are just the beginning. That's the moment your purpose comes into view. We are really able to get great one-on-one -on -one action with our professors. So you can't hide in your classroom. You're always actively participating. You'll get recommended for things that you might not have ever been interested in before, and you end up realizing that that might be your passion. Everyone here is just so nice, so welcoming. It's really easy to make friends here at Carthage. The biggest change was going from student to young business professional. I love Carthage. It's definitely the people. Living on the lake is amazing. I feel very prepared for my future. I ended up surpassing my expectations. Some things you just need to see for yourself. Come take a closer look at Carthage College. Oh, we're, we're live. Oh, I'm sorry. We're seeing a danger zone right there. But we are back with an oh, amazing, amazing, after an amazing game. <laughs> you can't just say, you're live. We're still hyping ourselves up. Oh, no. But we are back after an amazing 2-0 game. As Matt do going 7-0 against the Chokers on Clubhouse. It was a beautiful match today. Everybody on the Firebirds did just fantastic. Mm -hmm. It was beautiful to see. And... We're going 6-0 now in the NECC. We are undefeated. We might be the only undefeated team right now. Oh, let's go. It is beautiful to see. But we are here with our mystery guest, one of the top players of tonight, getting a 4K at one point, just being yeah. an absolute beast on Kali. We got Pauzy, guy. Let's go. The majestic, majestic reveal. Oh, my gosh. It's hair in my mouth. <laughs> How's it going, man? It's going pretty good. I gotta say something, though. I actually never played Kali once tonight. It was weird, but there's a reason. They left That's Thatcher right. open for us. Yeah, no, I noticed <laughs> that. that was... And I'm like, you're banning... Who did they ban? They banned, like... They was... banned Osa, because... It... Osa <laughs> and Nomad. Quis Quisby. Quisby just uh, bothered them so much with the Osa in the first game, just being able to get those annoying points and just giving us so much intel while mm -hmm. just staring at them, and we just round corners just to pick them <laughs> off. I was, um, that's great. Well, and one point on that last round too, they um, they ran a they initially picked a Glaz Kali, and we were like double sniper. Oh, and then right. they switched. Then they switched. Did you talk about us? No, no, the, no. the chokers. We did that too. You did that. Oh, too. No, oh, I didn't even see. Oh, that. We did that the first. <laughs> we did that the first round of on um, Clubhouse. We actually wound up. It locked me in Kali by accident, and then uh, uh, Nico picked. Uh, Glass and we just had two snipers, but I switched off to <laughs> Thatcher because Thatcher was wide open. I actually, I don't, I don't play Thatcher at all. I know, no, nobody. Does. Does. I don't. Thatcher is just so easy to He's use. So you just, it's just his his assault rifle. His like his and sledges. It's such a oh. good weapon. Mm -hmm. I can yes. play so well with it. And the fact that they just <laughs> let me, like they left Thatcher open, so we were able to just hard breach. Every yeah. round, yeah, every round, every, every way we wanted to be, and they couldn't stop us. They yeah, literally couldn't. Oh. That's like, I'm, we were shocked. We're just like, okay, we're just gonna hand them this round now yeah. because we're attacking first, so we're gonna easily get that first six rounds. And mm -hmm. as you did, you seven owed them. Just cleared straight through them. It was. Yeah. Did they even pick Thatcher that last round? I, I, I don't do remember. not remember. Don't even remember. if they did, it didn't make a difference. No. It was like, like as we know, that, that didn't make a difference. I, I, I don't know what happened that round. I was picked off instantly by Blitz. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> well, then there's Thermometer who's trying to get those sneaky spawn kills. He was just shot instantly. I <laughs> yeah. I know. We're sitting there. We're like, this is not going to end well. It's not gonna it end never well. really does end well. No, <laughs> but um, with the actual, like, just, I noticed that the Chokers played a lot of strategies that, like, you don't really see. A lot of those high risk just opening up all the walls and immediately pushing in kind of like a rush, uh, like a really fast one. I, I, I don't like, like there. It just seemed off to me. What were your thoughts? It's a, it's a strategy that works when we didn't expect it at mm -hmm. first. So of those first couple rounds, they won while they were on the attacking side was because they just, as you said, they breach every wall, smoke everything and plant somewhere where we didn't know where they were planting. Yeah. So we'd wind up having trouble. But as we figured out that this is what they're doing, we just decided, okay, we're just going to hunker down the base <laughs> and just make sure they don't get through, which it slowly worked, but sadly we wound up going through a couple more attacking rounds, but on the attacking side, on Villa, for some reason, our defense is not the best, but on attacking <laughs> side, we know what we're oh, doing. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Uh, well, except for yeah. that one grenade with Maverick I want. <laughs> that you're going to say it. I'm about to say I'm like, you were doing great using that Maverick, that Maverick trick, as I'll call it, where you 
open it up, throw a grenade in, and then Ace just opens it up, yeah, which is great. Electric. Except that one except time that, that it didn't work yeah, out for you, but, which moment. we knew. But we're then like, the next round, you're just like, you know what? I, I, I can't leave it to that. I didn't I, get a you got a frag kill. kill. I, I was expecting it to happen. It hasn't happened once in the season for the season that I've done it. I knew it was going to happen at some point at some time because it's just it's inevitable. There was it's going to be a mistake at yeah. some point, and mm -hmm. it finally happened. Uh, Whoops. <laughs> <laughs> it happens. It, it was like uh, the first few uh, games when people were falling off the falling off the <laughs> Nobody side. fell off this time. No, no, nobody no. fell off, which I'm so proud of. Uh, we're learning. We're learning not to fall off. We are learning. You know, That's a good well. achievement. Uh, oh, yeah. But, I mean, it, how did it feel? Like, you, you played Thatcher, though, but, like, um, playing Maverick, you know, you normally don't play Maverick that often. Maverick right? is actually one of my favorite ops. Really? Oh, yeah. I, didn't know, I mean, you usually play Kali. So. I, I usually, well, I play... Uh, Soft breach or support, which is just Kali and Maverick. When I'm not mm -hmm. playing Kali and I want something that's not a sniper but can still get through reinforcements, I normally play Maverick. So <laughs> I can help get through those breaches, but I don't have to worry about taking one shot and then just losing the fight. Well, keep it up because it's working out. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> Maverick's I, fun. Yeah. Well, and so we had, we've been talking all stream. We were having so many audio issues today and we learned that that's just Siege right now. I actually didn't have any audio issues with that game, but I heard some of my teammates mm -hmm. were having issues with it. So we were having, we had next to no audio for the entire stream. That's we could so hear um, pings. We had like white noise. Like even now, we have a little bit of white noise now. But in game, we had like the white, the sound effect where when Wait, your drone destroys, your like the static. Mm -hmm. oh, we had yeah. that constantly. We couldn't hear gunshots. We couldn't hear explosions. Yeah. So it was really hard for us to follow the game. And it was just all of a sudden we'd see like. Posse guy gotta kill. Posse guy gotta kill. And we're like, right. something's right. happening. You gotta switch to Posse guy. But like, how did you know? How do you think? How were you guys able to work around that? Uh well, as I said, I didn't have the issue myself, but my teammates were able to just. They start. They probably less trusted their ears and more mm -hmm. trusted callouts mm -hmm. that we could see. Cause that's a lot of it you know we can trust our ears a lot in the game but if the game's really screwing up with the sound <laughs> then we gotta yeah trust everything else we can get our hands on which is why we wound up using a lot of drones we had a lot of drones just placed all over the map whenever we get the chance and we had a lot of cameras placed down with maestro and just deployable cameras mm -hmm. just everywhere we could put them just to allow to yeah. try and counteract that sound issue well that's awesome having yeah. that trust it's just like that just makes you like y'all just next level mm -hmm. like when it comes to siege it's just like that like, communication is key and if you have sure. communication down it's really easy to, to get the upper hand yeah um going in this is the first game we've had on year seven though what are your thoughts well i'm excited for year seven of course we can't play a zombie <laughs> can't play a zombie this year i'm extremely excited for the season uh She's an incredibly cool op, and the, the attacker is six pick. I gotta say though, that's or not six pick. Re -pick. The attacker re pick. And yeah, six picks. That's what we used to use. But the re pick is a process that's really changed the way the game works, especially since defense has no six pick now. Defense has to know what they're playing and mm -hmm. not make a mistake locking them in, which the PCs kind of give us trouble sometimes when they won't let us pick our operator. Yeah. But that's uh, that's probably, we were able to work around that. Get some decent teams out there with mm -hmm. it. And we still won, so yeah, yeah it worked out. With that, so, um, so how how did that um, did that affect uh, you, you guys today at all, or uh, uh, having that um, attacker repick? Well, with the attacker repick, we were able to, of course, like I said on that first clubhouse round, we picked two snipers by accident, so we were able to switch off the mistake. But not even like with a mistake, we can develop certain strategies while we're droning them out and yeah. you know see how things are going. Like you know, if they're in basement, we switched from Ace to Havana because Ace can't go through hatches, but Havana can get them really well. Yeah. So we were able to make sure we're able to breach really well, get into certain places mm -hmm. when they're not where we're they're expecting them to be. Yeah. Now, um, last question of the night. All right. How do you feel about going into playoffs? Well, Making it to the thing. state championships. <laughs> I think it's going to be pretty cool to do. It's yeah. uh, really exciting, honestly. I kind of completely forgot that we did. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm keeping track on two different teams here. I don't oh, know yeah. what's going where. Having two different leagues and stuff, it's, you know, we don't stream the Wisconsin R6 League because it doesn't line up with some of our streaming schedules. But uh, we will, April 2nd, for the actual state championship, we'll be streaming all three games in that case because it's, uh, yeah, it's three games that day, uh, three different matchups. So um, I'm, I'm excited to do it. Uh, I'm excited to host. I'm honored to be chosen for that. <laughs> and it's going to be at Carthage. We're going to be, it's going to be here. We're going to be having all these schools come in and it's going to be, it's going to be awesome to experience. So that's going to be quite interesting. And they're going to have to deal with our PCs, not loading just as we deal with them every day. <laughs> <laughs> they're on the straight, they're an even playing field then. Um, but that's all we have for tonight. Thank, Thank you so, so much, much for joining us. It has been 
absolutely amazing to watch you play and watch you destroy even these even with these technical difficulties but night. to the viewers at home thank you so much for joining us uh we'll be back to well we won't be back tomorrow night our overwatch game will be broadcast on the necc channel at it's a nine o'clock game it's a little bit of a late game i will admit um against carol 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 okay. university <laughs> um so it's gonna be awesome to see thank you so much for joining us be sure to follow us on all of our social medias at Cartha D Sports. We got a little bit of a shout out there today. Uh, so definitely <laughs> like that photo, share it, tell your friends. Uh, it's going to be a great, great, great uh, time. So uh, thank you so much for watching and we hope to see you again next week. Take it easy, Firebirds.